Hi, everybody. It's me, Sergato. How y'all doing? Y'all doing all right? Also, hi. It's me, Tom. I'm here, here, too. Tom is here. So, Sar has forced forced me into this. Tom, your audio levels are off the chain. I'm just, it's actually great. I'm just I told you I'm to correct just it. Kidding with you. Also, what I love is that I had subtitles on that whole time, so if anybody was looking at closed captions, they would have saw what I was talking about. So, nothing you said, Tom. It's all that embarrassing stuff he said. All stay that incredibly, us. incredibly dirty stuff that Sar was talking about. Yeah, right. Because that, that's standard for our our chats. Well. Okay. Cool. The controller has uh, decided uh, to start working now. Uh, That's gonna bug me all the time. Hold on. There's some. I'm assuming it's popsicle on my monitor. Because my kids sometimes come in here and cut open the freezy pops and then they spray my screen with goop. Oh. Now I want. I want freezy pops. <laughs> she gets freezy like, what the fuck's. Don't. I think. Uh. Was it? Was it deer when they were trying a bunch of sour stuff, had sour freezies, yeah. and said they were fucking amazing? Yeah, and I bought some, and they're very good. <sighs> yeah, they're I don't very good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're, they're uh, the Warheads freezies. Mm. They are, they're very flavorful, and they're pretty sour. Definitely. If I remember correctly, they, they ranked very high on their list. Okay. I'm ready to hit go whenever you're ready to go there, Tom. Uh, I... Oh. Click into the game. There we go. Also, you know it's a high-quality port when there's no audio settings. No audio settings. <laughs> not in the default menu. Maybe it's an in-game menu, but uh, it's not mm. there in, in the opening menu. Is it under extras? No. Nope. <laughs> It's just like, yeah, the game's a little louder than I would like. And uh, I had to open up the volume mixer to fix. Because <laughs> it's. Oh, it's a lot of YouTube. I can definitely crank that down. <laughs> On the levels, it looks good. But. Alright. And. You ready? As ready as I'll ever be. All right, three, two, one. New game. Speed uh, run. I gotta name uh, everybody. Uh, I'm not gonna name it. Those look good. A long lived peace. These pixels are thick, mm -hmm. nice and juicy. Yep. Is that an end? <laughs> I feel like you needed an evil laugh. Who <laughs> needed that? Need the Kefka laugh. All right. The Emperor of Palamecia has got. Oh my God, that went so that fast. Has begun it. his campaign for World Conquest. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get you into shit. A rebel army arose in the kingdom. Are you kidding me? With how fast these things. <laughs> <sometimes? laughs> But the rebel's castle fell on an all-out assault by the Empire. Good job. You did it. <laughs> hey, we're the Empire! Nice to meet you! How you doing? It's yeah, difficult to say if they're evil. Left with little choice, the rebels withdrew to the remote town of Altair. It's a secretly an Assassin's Creed prequel. Mm. Four youths from Finn also found themselves fleeing the Imperial forces. They had lost their parents at the hand of the Empire. But their escape wasn't over. I have to do like a 1920s announcer. <laughs> Assume to be three youths. Oh, we're fighting. Uh, we'll win. Surely. I think this is the one we automatically lose, right? Either way, I'm going to spread out the attacks. I missed. I missed. I missed. Holy shit. Yeah, this is a forced loss. Why would you start the game with a forced losing battle? Um... Uh... To show how dire the situation is. I guess, but at the same time... Hey, Shadow Mage. How you doing? Will he live? 
He will. Yep. I sense a strong life force within him. He should regain consciousness soon. You can do Hilda. We found them like this on the escape from Finn, fallen from terrible wounds. By the time we brought them here, I feared it was already too late. His life is not in danger. This sigil will strengthen his life force. We should let him rest now. Of course. We'd best be off to the meeting. I imagine they're already waiting for us. The Empire is allowed to complete the Dreadnought they're building in Bafsk. Their attack will be begin in earnest. Cannot sit idly by and watch. We must act. Also, Bafsk. Bafsk, yeah. The, the dread hell of a name. I think the Dreadnought's like the only... Well, the Dreadnought and the, some of the Emperor stuff is like okay from like a plot perspective in this. Mm -hmm. Here you can be free. Also, the main characters have voices. Where, where am I? Leon? Maria? D guy? <laughs> where are you? It's funny too, because in like three, they become much more generic too. Yep. Freon, oh. you're alive! I thought, I thought you'd. I'm fine, Maria. Are you though? Uh, we'll see. You seem all right too, guy. But wait, where's Leon? He's fucking dead. Princess of Finn, save us. It's not Beaver. Leon, not here. That's Why not, is he? That's not Beaver. A doofus. <laughs> I see. Don't worry. I'm sure he's okay. We got our full party now. And there will be out of three and be, no one else. And we'll be out of sync here shortly. Yep. So you regained your strength. Very good. Your life force is strong indeed. It was you who saved us, wasn't it? Thank you. Forgive me, your highness. But there's something I might must ask of you. Please let us join the rebel army. <laughs> <laughs> I could never allow such a thing. You know nothing of battle. You'd only be throwing your lives away. You should rest and return to your homes. But we have no homes. Not anymore. The Imperials attacked, and our parents... Our parents... Well, they turned into zombies or ghosts or something, maybe. I'm truly sorry. But that changes nothing. I cannot permit you to join our army. If you've nowhere else to go, you're welcome to stay here in Altair. If you know our password, you should be able to live here well enough. Password is Wild Rose. Remember it well. Yay for key phrases. I mean, key phrases can be done well. I ask you about the Wild Rose. The Wild Rose is the insignia of the Kingdom of Finn. It represents our hope for a flourishing future of strength and beauty. But what will become of Finn? I've heard that the Empire's captives suffer there in confinement, even as we speak. Maria, your brother Leon is missing, is he not? It's possible that he's being held in Finn as well. How do you even know who these people are? Right. And how do you know that Leon's her brother? But Finn is far too dangerous to travel now. The Emperor's beasts still stalk the streets. Any entrance to the city will not be easy. The man at my right is Minwu, the white wizard who tended your wounds. Speak with him before you leave. He may be of some assistance. I don't think I talked to Minwu. I gotta go back and do that. I've already started looting rooms and stuff. Okay. Hey, you? Did I, did I talk to you? I might have already talked to him. Nothing happens. Teleport me. <laughs> no, don't explain attributes to me. Ah, the King of Finn can't fight anymore. He got struck in the... Took an arrow to the knee. Yeah, the opening segment or whatever. Oh, that feels weird. You can walk diagonally. Yeah. That feels oh, weird. Oh, you can. You can also run. Oh. I don't know if you found that button yet. I do now. And I was rewarded for my running efforts with a potion. Yeah, let me ask you about the Wild uh, Rose. What about the Wild Rose? What about the Wild Rose? Alright. 
to the armor shop first. I, armor shop? <laughs> Weapon shop first. Alright, buckler. Give me as many as I can buy. How many can I buy? Four, I can buy eight. I only need six, though. Thank you. Alright, equip. No, you don't need a broadsword. You need another buckler. And you don't need a bow. You need a buckler and a buckler. And, uh, hey, uh, guy, here's a buckler and a buckler. I guess I didn't need to buy <laughs> six because I already had two. This is the magic shop. Shoot. I guess we'll learn here. Thanks. I use it. How does magic work in this again? Maria, you can learn here first. Alright. Oh, okay. That's what I was doing. Out of the world. Let's join the army, Mr. President. Oh, look, Final it's most forgotten Final Fantasy. To activate the maximum grindage in the party, huh? No! I'm, I just got shields. It's fine. Don't worry about it. You're right, Nikki. I apologize for copying Sar. What did you copy me for? What? Did you buy two? Did Playing you buy... the same game. Oh, I was going to say, did you buy <laughs> shields? No, I bought weapons. Which is probably a bad idea, but it's fine. No, I've never played this before. This is literally the first time I've ever played it. Apparently, Tom's cheated on me, though, back in high school and played it. Also, my losing health to poison as I'm walking doesn't look like it. That's good. Are you already out in the overworld? Maybe. You're too fast, dang it, Sar. Grinding already. <laughs> I don't even I have I don't even have spells. I have one spell, that's all I can afford. It's the main reason I'm out here is I need more money for more spells. I think Maria's is gear a... is gonna do like two HP or something ridiculously small. <laughs> uh, actually like fifty, that's not too bad. Alright, let's get it. Stretch already. How dare you, Nikki? How dare you? But it's good to see Max. Thanks for stopping by, Max. Really appreciate it. Hold on. We'll listen to the battle music. It's pretty good. While I stretch. A hydrate and a stretch. I can't stretch or hydrate, and I'm grinding. I might be able to hydrate one handed, but stretching is going to be harder. Give me a second. So, Sar, why, why did you decide to force this game upon us again? I've forgotten. Oh. It'd be funny, I thought. Yeah, you can adjust the volume levels in game, by the way. Because, of course, you can. Of course. You can. Yeah, it is. How do I. Can I not continue auto battle? Sure, I guess. Is there a way to turn up the speeds, though? Really? Configuration... Hey. I don't know what the button is for auto battle. There we go. I found it. Alright, we're good! Square, apparently. My entire party is level 2 with shields now. <laughs> Amazing. Just a random ass airship that flew by. <laughs> I honestly can't remember why you want to give everybody shields, but uh, I guess to make them more useful. Yeah, I equipped. I equipped two shields to make them more useful. <laughs> Well, you will instantly get them to, like, really high levels. You also won't be, like, doing any damage or anything, eh? Unless you are doing damage with... <laughs> Do pretty decent damage with the shields, to be honest with you, yeah. <laughs> Back in the day, you couldn't do damage if you did that? Really? Oh, really? 
Oh, looks like I'm going to have to go back and buy shields. Because, <laughs> yeah, I, I remember that it, when I played it back in high school. Was I had a party member who just had shields and did no damage whatsoever. Yeah, I've, been, I've been fighting all this stuff so far. It's been going great. Now, obviously, the monsters are hitting me enough to gain, like, health and or the other stats I need, but they're getting strength, which, you know, mm -hmm. is real important. Actually, no, it's great. I'm not even my father. Uh, hmm? Hey, Roddy. Oh, you're doing the emo stuff? Howdy, Roddy. Thanks for that, emo Roddy. Stuff. You're a good helper, Roddy. What's Roddy doing? I don't know if I'm, I'm allowed to publicly talk about it. Okay, well, it's emote stuff, apparently. <laughs> I got time. It's another random airship. <laughs> Not the leg eaters. Thank God they're attacking me. I gotta turn off auto battle. We need to heal. Because I think if I remember correctly too, like spamming heal without actually healing anything doesn't actually like increase it either. It has to yeah. actually like increase so you... <laughs> the. So you need them to take damage to gain health, and you need them to take damage so that you can actually gain uh, actual cure attuned. If I remember correctly. Make sure to save every now and again. Oh, that's a good point. I haven't saved yet. <laughs> I should probably do that. I got hands up. That's good. Which I think is technically how my guys are uh, taking... doing damage. Just technically hand damage. Uh. Who doesn't like a little hand damage in the morning? You know what I'm saying, gamers? <laughs> oh, we can take off auto battle. Maria can heal herself after this. 69! Oh. Nice! Oh, that's what I was going to I was going to turn on continue auto battle as a setting. Yes. So it just stays on. <laughs> yes. No, that was that was the nifty one. <laughs> Maria got some MP up and some magic skill up. Neat. How am I doing money-wise? Doing okay. Let's go grab some more spells. Guess antidotes or poisons healed, but battle. Yeah, I saw that. Hmm. Weird, isn't it? Um, like that for sure was not the case in the original. You would have had to grind so much more <laughs> yeah. to keep up freaking antidotes because you keep getting poisoned constantly every time you run into horns. So let's. You can know thunder. You can know fire for now. You can know blizzard for now. Link here and you can link here. I I'll, I'll get one spell. Actually, nope. This town doesn't have spells, so I'm not getting any spells. Oh, you went to the second town already? It's a tiny little village. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm still doing that Final Fantasy thing where you just walk around the first town for a while. I've basically already decided I'm not going to care too much about the story, so I'm just kind of yeah. <laughs> zooming. Can I get you? But my characters have to all be level 100 with maxed out magic stats before I'll move on. But they don't have levels! My level 3 shield skill says otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my goodness. That's. Hmm. Shield and hands up. I got an HP increase without taking much damage. Hmm. Very cool. Concerning. Up oh, free and got some HP. Which everybody just got HP. Nice. Okay. 
Let's go rest at the inn quick, and then we'll head on to the next town, I guess. Twenty-four! That's such a rip-off. <laughs> Grind some gold real quick so I can actually buy spells. If I remember correctly, it's like every spell type, too, is its own level or whatever, isn't it? Like, fire Probably. is its own thing. All the times before jobs. Yeah, right. Where you could so, so nicely. It would put points into all black magic instead of just a singular black magic. Right. I can hit all? Seriously? Seems broken as fuck. Never mind, this US not broken as fuck down. Maria, you're gonna be an assassin. You have no HP for it, but you're gonna do great, honey. Actually, she's probably best as a mage. You're uh, figure out only fire. Yeah. Why is the mini map so large and I don't know how to change it back? But your fire, like your spell increases though as you like you unlock the like level two fire, like level three fire as you use it more or whatever. That's how it works instead. Could you actually hurt us? I can't please? remember if it just flat out just increases and that's it. Hello, Gatria. Are you the gateway to this game? Oh, man. How much to stay at this inn? 29? That's more expensive than the last town. Hmm. Can you sell me something? I don't want to buy any of those things. That's what I want. What the heck? There's goblins in these streets. Why are the three bears here? What the hell? Imperial forces have occupied the town. But Leon might be there. I bet better shields here. And I still get bucklers. I can still only get bucklers, but I can sell a couple of them because I took too many last time. Uh, I have two of them. Actually, we're not going to use the broadsword. Or the axe. Or the bow. Oh, God! Noted. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> you know what? It probably wasn't my smartest idea to just try and say hi. Uh, to one of the guards? Yeah, to one of the guards in the next town. They attacked. They're pretty strong. They did a... Uh, they did 500 damage. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, hey, yeah, you're safe in this chat. Did y'all know that Tom streams and is devilishly handsome? I mean, I don't know why you think you're safe. Also, I do see that, Max. 
Oh, I don't have, have Sars chat open. <laughs> I don't have Tom's chat open right now. Fuck me. Wow. Sorry, give me mod cars real quick. All right, need to second. test the thing. Yeah, okay. Give me a second. Did it go through? I don't know if it went through. There we go. Okay, you can take it away. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> oh, another airship. Max, Max tempted fate. So many airships. The price for it. They messed around and found out. All right, here we go. Look, I don't care about the ad. I just want the chat, okay? Pop out chat. There we go. Okay, problem rectified. Yeah, I know, Tom's killing people up in here. It's crazy, isn't it, Nikki? I only slayed one person today. So far. So far. Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh. What did uh -oh. you do? I told you not to talk to them. I didn't talk to them. I went south and I wasn't supposed to. Oh. <laughs> Hey, Stitch. Hi, Stitch. Things are going well. Wait. Oh. In order to revive a dead party member, you can't just rest at an inn. Really? You can't just rest at an inn. Configuration settings don't change, but uh, like save. So if you want to turn on auto battle between whatever you need to turn it on every time you reload a save, it looks like. Ooh. Yeah. Yay, Fury on Thunder no, level. I mean, I mean, ooh, as in, uh. Not great for me. Already won a hundred battles. What? <laughs> Don't get too close to the Imperial soldiers. Hmm. You need a staff. Oh, you got to take them to a a church in town to revive. That's how it works. <laughs> Welcome back, Max. Welcome back. Wonder why you took a short break there. I don't wonder. 
<laughs> Nobody to sell me stuff in this armor shop. What the hell? Plaza the personnel uh, he kissed to bring back to life. Yeah, that's interesting. Oh, fuck. Okay, I can't go in the castle yet. Did I miss something in the town? The house over there. Go check out that house, I guess. With the current level of enemies, I apparently can't get past three, so... Staff is probably a two-handed weapon, right? Well, is there any two-handed weapons in this game, or is everything one-handed? You can just dual wield everything. Like, you can just dual wield everything. No. Bow is two-handed. At least. I'm not sure about many other things, but at least bow is two-handed. You can't have anything in your offhand. Stupid game, not letting us have... Shield bow is an option. This isn't monster hunter. You can't just have like. A <laughs> just realized that I need to heal. So we can, which means we should, so we can work on leveling up our curing spell. You can do wield staffs though. <laughs> well, why would you ever use a staff in this? Well, it doesn't increase your magic power when you have a staff equipped. Doesn't look like it. Okay. I'm just gonna have her bonk things. I stand by my statement of why would you ever use a staff then? Guys, hurt. I should have healed them. Fuck. I also know we don't want to over level because every level makes the spells cost a lot more as well. I'll check max the next time I get an opportunity, which won't be for a second. Yes, there is a defense. There is. Well, why would you? When you have two shields, you're always defending. I mean, when I'm fighting stuff that's roughly like my skill level, yeah, I just the most of the time I block. But when I got hit by that bear that hit for 300 in one hit, that was um spicy. <laughs> needs to heal. I've been told to go sit on my butt for a few minutes while thing process how is the game. Um it's it's so far it's not that bad. But it's also like incredibly stupidly easy right now too. Mm-hmm. So like that's definitely a factor. And also, like, I'm aware of some of the jink with this game, and I'm definitely already trying to exploit it, if that makes sense, right? So. <laughs> Sar notoriously breaking games, as per usual. If I went in here not knowing the little bit I know, like, blind and just picking it up off the shelf, especially as, like, a young kid, I would probably be, like, super upsetty spaghetti, so... I'm not abusing the jink quite yet. Oh. 
Well, I could be, but like, I'm not trying to break the game. I'm just trying to jink the game, right? Maria's cure leveled up, finally! Yeah. But now we, like, don't want to use it very often because we don't want it to level up again, which that's the stuff in this game that's weird, right? Like... <laughs> you want it to be strong, but not too strong. Right. Make sure to attack. Wouldn't I kill my own party members right now, though? Oh, I gotta go to the top of town, don't I? Get through there. Damn it. Okay, hold on. I have a rough idea what I need to do. Mm, uh, fire is so strong at rank one. <laughs> oh, yeah. Can you free this Imperial City first, or no? So far, I have not been able to find a way to free them. Yep. I regret this decision. <laughs> Maria's dead. Hmm. Maria, Ain't that neat. Maria's fucking dead! We have to go to the bar on the outskirts? Yeah, that's what I think you gotta do, but I think you gotta go around the top. Which mm. I was just about to do, but then uh, I was like, yeah, I'll try hitting Maria. Let's see what happens. <laughs> and Maria fucking died. Who could have seen this coming? I did. I was like, this is why I haven't done it yet. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do too much damage at this point with my party. Alright, guy. Heal, Fury, and... Yeah, why would I defend? <laughs> We're just like dragging her in the dirt. Mm -hmm. If only it had the... Um, uh, like the some of the other RPGs where your party members follow you around. Right. <laughs> Maria would be just face down. Well, that's what, uh, Drag behind you. That's what, uh, Max just pointed out. These Dragon Quest mm. gives you coffins, right? Hmm. Earthbound has ghosts, characters. Nikki, what have you done? What have you sabotaged? This is secretly a speedrun, and they're just trying to get you additional time. This town doesn't have a church. Okay, well, I can't do anything here. <laughs> Let's keep going. The very first town has a church. Yep, I'm going. I'm going. Also, man, my fire's too strong already. It costs two MP. I got every one of my uh, offensive spells to level two, so that if you do like an AOE attack, it's actually like worth something. But yeah, at two MP, it's pretty costly to use it constantly, so. Oh, hmm. Hey, bartender. How you doing? Oh, Tom's making progress again. Oh? There's a secret door in the bar. You need to use Wild mm -hmm. Rose to get in, I'm Gasp. sure. We sure do to use Wild Rose. And there's a treasure chest with potions. Where the hell's the church here? Hi, Scott. Oh, here's the church. Prince Scott. Oh. Hey, you see this corpse? Can you do something about this? Thanks. Appreciate it. Yeah. 
You know, they could have fixed some of the jank of, of this game. Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, that's ridiculous. <laughs> they just... <laughs> I'll let you experience that one. That's that, that one's a treat. Okay, I'm heading back to the <laughs> town now. Got some strength up. Jank. Yeah, I know they fixed some jank, and yeah, it's surprising how much jank there still remains. <sighs> eh, well, yeah, maybe. It depends on what they're doing. The glut of games they're releasing this fourth quarter this year is ridiculous, though. What games are coming out this fourth quarter? I honestly don't remember, but I know it's a ridiculous <laughs> amount. The only one that comes to mind off the top of my head is Hell Harvestia, but they also have a three. So they released uh, Triangle Strategy earlier this year, right? Triangle Strategy. But then there's a 3D live a live. strategy game coming out this fall. Hmm. I'm blinking on the name right now. So I don't know what happened, but these enemies are giving me so much more gold now. Yeah, Live A Live just came out recently, which I've only played through. I haven't even finished it, but the... Uh... I want to play it, and I will get around to it eventually, maybe. It's super fun. I've only done the prehistoric timeline, was all I was going to say, and I really enjoy what I've played of it, but it's just hard to balance everything. Mm -hmm. I've been trying to get through Octopath again recently. Because the second one was announced. I feel like i got to beat the first one before I buy the second one, right? And, um... Today I discovered side quests. Oh. And they're really... There's a lot of them, and some of them are kind <laughs> of complicated. And so that's been... slowing my progress down, too, so... Yeah, I'm on chapter one of everyone, so I'm, like, <laughs> progress has been very slow for me. And I'm at, like, 23 hours or something played in that game or something dumb. Oh, live at life. Okay, uh, I don't need anything. Let's go to the place. Shoot out, I get to the palace again. Uh, how do I get to the palace again? Uh, yeah, I don't like how they separate the storylines of the characters. I feel like, oh, being that's able to... the. Okay. Sure are a lot of Imperial Guard guys in here that I don't want to talk to. The bartender's just like, fuck it. Mm-hmm. Shoot. No, 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 no. I wonder if we need a potion to save this person. My name is Scott. I'm the Prince of Kashwan. Us. So celebratory. To hell to that lover. No! Have you 
Have you heard of my brother Leon? Why don't we just take him back to the statue of the... Oh, never mind. Permanent death. You got to the end, but you didn't finish. Uh, Bravely Default 2 is the one that I really want to get back to, because I imagine at some point the plot in that's got to get real good. Because the first game is so majestic. Second layer or whatever... I think I got like halfway through, and I just it never really vibe with me the same way though. So, hmm. to Hades with you. Uh, did did you notice the thing? No. Uh, well, uh, Scott died, and then he got his ring. He's just like, you got the ring. Ba -ba 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 -ba. It's like, <laughs> that's a good point. Cool. <laughs> I was phased by it. Sorry. <laughs> but see, like, I imagine there's got to be a big twist into it, the story, right? Like, at some point. That's. But again, I didn't get super far into it. Because the problem with 2 is every single time I ran into a super monster, I wanted to kill it immediately. And, uh... Spent many, many hours fighting super monsters, like, to figure <laughs> out the perfect strategy to beat them. Well, because that's the thing, like, the first Bravely Default, the story goes a lot of crazy places. And I don't want to provide details on it, because I feel like everybody should experience it fresh. Um, even though it is incredibly frustrating, and, in, in, and like, if you don't know, you need to just keep keep keeping on or whatever, right? Like, it is, uh... I could definitely see myself as, like, petering off if I didn't know that I need to keep pushing, so. Am I dead? I might be dead. Ow. I do really enjoy the combat, yeah. And by, like, super monsters, I mean, like, they'll have, like, an enemy in, like, an area that is, like, 20 levels higher than the rest of the enemies in that zone or whatever, right? That drops like a really nice item if you fight it, so. Okay, don't go this area yet. Yeah, you, you gotta be like, look, I understand this is weird and boring and stupid, but like you need to push on through. Like, it's amazing. And even if you get like the bad ending, it's still really neat. Like, in my mind. I think I, I, th I, think I did both, because I think if it's possible for you to do the like correct, correct ending and like the, the bad end or whatever. Hmm. Where can I go? Wait, what? Oh, it was in uh, here. Bravely Default is is a game that I want to play for the combat system and really don't want to play because of the visuals. That's fair. I really don't like its art style at all. I mean, I it, it, it's but... it's very, or it's almost precisely the same as uh oh shit, <sighs> am I dead again? Uh, but yeah, it, it's very Final Fantasy mobile version or Final Fantasy 3D remake version graphics, and I it doesn't do anything for me. <laughs> Look who's dead. I mean, I am. the second game I think looks good, but I understand what you're saying. Oh, the story is fucking amazing. But again, I, I, I guess without spoiling the details, I could talk about the premise as a whole. Because <laughs> you, you have to play through the game multiple times. Um, and again, once you've, you've done that a few times, it really starts to feel like, why the fuck am I doing this again and again and again? <laughs> it's deliberate. There's plot reasons. Push through. <laughs> That's my suggestion. 
<laughs> and if you're getting sick of it, because what I did is once you start, like, there's a certain point where you're just, you're re you're hitting your, like, it's kind of almost like New Game Plus, and you're just cycling through again and again and again. Mm. Once you hit that point, um, there is a very good place to grind levels and job experience from. Um, and one of the most amazing things about those games is you can either crank up the encounter rating or turn it off where you get no random nice. encounters whatsoever if you're just trying to get from A to B or looking for treasure or whatever the other case might be. And, uh, man, when it, you just you grind your character to max level with the job you want them to be maxed out or whatever, right? And then the cycles literally take like two minutes to go through. <laughs> and like, again, the one method of grinding, you'll max out your characters in a very short period of time. Because again, you crank up the encounter rating all the way up, right? And then you almost like auto battle your way through it. It's amazing. And like, yeah, it's stupid that I'm suggesting you like skip the grind in a game that's very <laughs> like grind heavy or whatever, right? But the fucking story is worth it. Like, fuck. <laughs> it's so fucking cool. Yeah, it does literally toy with the New Game Plus idea as well, right? That's neat. But I understand, Tom. And also, I <laughs> the problem I have is, like, I don't want to play anything on a 3DS. But I have an original yeah. 3DS. My screen is tiny, right? And, like, I can't... My hands have always hurt after playing on it for, like, an hour, right? Yeah, it is uh, not built for large hands. No, you're right, Nikki. 100%. 100%. There's, there's a lot of times you got to go through. Because <laughs> I think you, I think it's four and then another oh, God. four. The game's not correctly. short, is it, either? It's not particularly short. Um, And, like, so there's, there's, like, little differences and, like, little cool things they do in between each cycle. Mm. Even, like, the later ones. But, like, you don't have to do any of that. You can just jump right to the main objectives and just get to the next cycle. <laughs> like, once you know how to do that, like, you can just say, fuck talking to all the NPCs and seeing all their individual story stuff, whatever. Some of it's cool. But you can just be like, fuck it, I'm just going. But I do recommend unlocking all the optional jobs as soon as you possibly can, which I think you can do them all in the first cycle, if I remember correctly. The one is really challenging, though. I don't remember the the job off the top of my head right now, Nikki, but you get it from the vampire. <laughs> Howdy, man. Thanks for stopping by. Also, wow. It feels odd to me. Is the job vampire? Yes, then I'm sorry about the job vampire. Feels odd to me that I would be called cute and Sar would be called handsome. Just like, why am I not called handsome? Suck it. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't have to get in the last. You, the, you can go hunt the dragons, Shh, I believe, in your first, one of your first Max, cycles. That never happened. It's very early you Max, can get it. never happened. Quickly. It's just very hard because each of the dragons is like four times stronger than like the normal bosses you would fight in that cycle. So it, mm. it is a it is a bit of a challenge. And like they are hard 
bosses to beat. And that's just to get access to the dungeon where you get the job. Then the whole dungeon is also very hard. But again, you can turn on your corners if you want to. But then you still have to <laughs> fight the boss at the end. So, like, that doesn't... It's not going to help you. <laughs> that makes sense, right? Like... <laughs> There's a reason you shouldn't turn off your encounters. I, uh... I honest... I'm honestly excited to play Octopath Traveler 2. Because Octopath 1... I really wanted to play for the art style and the combat system seems excellent. Combat um, awesome. And then that's <laughs> all I heard is just like, yeah, like I'm not someone who's driven by story, but I mean, RPGs, I mean, story kind of is what drives you forward. So I care a little bit more. Uh, and I'd heard <laughs> in Octopath, it's just like, yeah, it's just eight really separate stories. There's no reason for like any of these characters to actually spend time with each other. <laughs> They're very disconnected stories. So that kind of put me off from ever trying it, even if the combat system was really up my alley. And yeah. now it seems, hopefully, with a lot of the feedback they got, that the Octopath 2 will be better suited in that. And I'm just like, this might be a good spot for me to get in on it. Yeah, see, I don't know if... um, I don't know if you... I'm I'm still nervous. <laughs> I guess what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Cause like I a lot of people's chief complaint or like one of the things I when I was mentioning to people about this again, they were like, Well yeah, it's pretty cool that you're gonna have the ability to have uh two uh like interactions between because one of the, one of the things is in the main the majority of the chapters and stuff as you're interacting with folks or whatever, they they don't ever interact with each other's plots, basically, right? Everyone's stories are all kind of self contained, right? Mm -hmm. Um, which, you know, isn't great. Um, <laughs> but that's not my main problem. My main problem is, like, if you do find a story that you are kind of, like, vibing with, you're like, ah, oh, this is a pretty cool story. I'm really enjoying this or whatever, right? And then, uh, you, you go and, uh, th there's a huge level gap between each of them, basically, right? So that's mm -hmm. where, that's where I'm right now. I literally just finished all, everyone's chapter ones. Um, the person you pick first is um like you're 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 stuck with them in octopath one mm -hmm. basically they're like your your key character or whatever they're always locked into your party and then everyone else is you know they can come and go as you please basically right <laughs> so like picking the wrong primary party member too could theoretically kind of be problematic because there are definitely some who are way better than others and you also have an overworld ability that uh, you have to use to solve a bunch of the, the side quests, and I'm assuming some of the main plot stuff eventually as well, right? Um, and you have to level everybody if you want to actually do everybody's storylines too, but anyway, we'll get to that. Uh, <laughs> so, what what sucks is, like, um, so I, I picked the rogue as the guy, and that's, I think, like, one of the best options, because um, being able to steal from all the various townspeople and stuff like that consistently is super helpful. <laughs> okay. Um, it's good to be a thief. Yeah. So sorry. Well, in Octopath, at least, right? Um, <laughs> but, like, some of the characters, like, if you picked, like, the mage guy, that would make things... Like, he's amazing because he can, like, clear boards, like, super effectively, right? Mm. Um, I think Ophelia is supposed to be, like, the one they want you to pick first, honestly. Because Ophelia is, like, the priest healer type person, basically, right? The alchemist is pretty cool, yeah. Um, and he's got... The alchemist has... I think he's got the... Uh, where he just talks to people ability, right? Which is kind of broken. Because basically, you, you can just go up to every single person in town and be like, hey, you know of any secrets or anything? And they're like, yeah. And then it gets revealed or whatever, right? Thanks, Slime. I appreciate that. Um, <laughs> whereas, like, the mage guy has... A lot of them have, like, similar effects to each other. But the difference is that, like, one of them is kind of, like, sinful. And you have, like, a chance to fail. And if you do, like, your reputation in that town goes down. And the other person will, like, not be... They just won't be able to do it if they don't meet the level requirement, basically, right? But if they fail, there's no penalty to you, basically, right? So, like, obviously, like, stealing, right, is bad. And so if you get caught stealing, your reputation goes down. The flip side of that ability is to buy stuff. With the merchant, you can go up to people and be like, hey, I want to, like, buy your stuff from you, right? Um... Yeah, the Huntress had to talk thing too, but it was uh, the Huntress has the uh, provoke ability, 
um, which is a percent to fail. And the thing I don't like about the Huntress one is like, so there's there's the knight has the ability to challenge somebody to a duel, and the Huntress's ability is effectively the same. But if you're using the Huntress to do it instead, she can only fight using her beasts in that duel. <laughs> Which, her beasts are very powerful. If you ca She's kind of like a Pokemon trainer almost, right? You weaken mm. beasts and you capture them, and then she uses them for her abilities. She's kind of like Blue Mage, I guess, in that regard, too. Mm. Um, but when you do her provoke ability and successfully provoke somebody, the fight, you can only use the beasts. Which... She has normal abilities, normal attacks without the beasts, but you don't, you can't use them when you do the provoke ability, which sucks. Whereas the knight, when he challenges somebody to a duel, he just fights them one on one. Which in a game that's designed for a party of four, one on one fights are fucking hard, <laughs> <laughs> but doable. Anyway, what was I saying? I was ranting about all this for a fucking reason. <laughs> Uh, okay, sorry, anyway, so, like, the abilities you have, like, on your overworld abilities in, like, your party, like, having that be balanced so you can, like, actually do all the interaction abilities is kind of important. Otherwise, you gotta go back to the tavern all the fucking time and swap people just to have the guy that can do the ability you want, right? Um, which isn't, like, the end of the world, but it just adds more, like, fucking around and shit, right? Because you can only change your party at a tavern. So you have mm. to be in a, a main town that has a tavern to be able to swap your party around. Um, but yeah, so what what sucks is, so I just finished all of everyone's chapter ones. My rogue character is now 20. Um, and the rest of my party ranges from anything from 11 to 17. Okay. And the next, the chapter two main quest lines for everybody that I have unlocked or whatever at this point, which is everybody at this point. Uh, starts at 23 is the recommended level. Yeah. So I have to do three levels of grinding with my main character to be within the recommended range, right? And to get, like, the rest of a party, like, in that average range, right? You're talking about many hours of grinding ahead of me, basically, right? Mm -hmm. Which I'm not, like, totally opposed to, but at the same time, like, oh my <laughs> god... Am. Like, please, for I the love of like God. <laughs> well, the thing that gets me about this more than anything, though, is the fact that, like, again, if there was somebody's story, like Ophelia, for instance, like, if you really were jammed with Ophelia's storyline, you need to get, like, 13 levels, 14 levels after you finish the first story with her to be able to do the next bit, right? And that is, that's, when you're playing eight different people's stories, basically, how are you supposed to keep all that stuff straight, basically, right? Mm-hmm. So, that's my... I don't even know what I'm really doing. <laughs> I was searching the overworld and found nothing. <laughs> I mean, I was Hopefully for... the cure auto-targets on a new ally. Oh good, it does. Okay, that works. I was trying to see if I could work on my st my, my, my shield some more, but unfortunately, even these <laughs> Sasquatches aren't enough of a high level for me to get any ranks up, apparently. <laughs> also, howdy, Bubbles. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, I have that to look forward to in a few days. <laughs> COVID booster. Side effects. I have mine scheduled for a couple days from now. <laughs> As well as a flu shot at the same time, so double up. It's gonna be great. Surely won't be knocked on my ass and very lazy at work. That's nothing new. That's not nothing new. <laughs> but yeah, that that is a a pain point for Octopath. It's like you have a if you want to progress any singular story. You have to progress others. <laughs> well, you don't technically have to. But it is the most efficient way to gain a bunch of the XP you need, right? But I'm also learning that some of the side quests that I have expect you to be, like, level 25 to do. Mm. And it doesn't really tell you that. 
So all of a sudden, like, you pick a fight with, like, somebody, and they, like, have, like, I think one had, like, 10,000 health, and I'm doing, like, 100 a round. That's gonna be a very long fight. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Um... Where's my head going? Um, Hopefully on your shoulders. Oh, Nikki, I I can't take the day off because uh, North Carolina does not have sick days as a standard policy. And I'm on contract, so that means I don't get any. Uh, and uh, I also am using up the last of my vacation days for two trips in October, so I don't have any vacation days to take either. So I was just, I was just about to I'm ask. just gonna deal with it. I was just about to ask what your second trip was, but I just remembered. Is RPG Limit Break? Yeah, everybody, go watch time at RPG Limit Break. Woot woot. Woot woot. Still a little salty <laughs> about that, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. What are you being salty about? Don't worry about it. It's fine. Everything's fine. What, do you want to fly out to Salt Lake City? Well, I mean, it's too late for me to figure this shit out now. <laughs> but it would have been nice to have been asked. So yes. there's like, it's like 80 people for the event. <laughs> it's not an SGDQ. I don't care, whatever. It'd be nice to see you. Excuse <laughs> to go to Salt Lake City. I actually probably have a kiss that we can though. So the answer would have been no anyway. But... <laughs> I'll hopefully be able to hang out with Nowl and, and Mithra while I'm there. Do I want to settle down here? No, I'm good. But I do have bronze shields now, so I'm even more of a threat to be reckoned with. Yeah, let's go. time. What's time running? You're running um, Hand of Gilgamesh, right? Yes, I'm running SteamWorld Quest. Which I'm going to have to like really uh, I'm gonna probably next week go back to my old stream schedule just to <laughs> keep up more practice because I've got DeerCon in between now and RPG Limit Break and I'm not gonna be um, I'm not going to be <laughs> practicing while I'm there, so I need to keep my practice up and to eventually start practicing my commentary for it as well. I think I fucked up. Ooh. I'm 90% sure I fucked up. Oh. What you played, yeah. <laughs> Howdy, Nicole. Thanks for stopping by with your important message. They said they can't hear you. I know. I'm saying it anyway. Everyone else can acknowledge that I responded. You're right. Him. I, I am dumb. It's fine. Um, oh my god, fuck. <laughs> it's... Mm. Yay, menu shield power has increased. You gave him shields to? Why not? Well, one shield at least. Is there anyone you didn't give shields to? No. <laughs> you snuck on audio, traitor. <laughs> Have a good dinner. Is this the city I wanted? 
don't think this is the city I wanted. I think I may have fucked up. There's a lot of fucking goblins. What? Yeah, probably. Why? Oh. There's multiple stages of poison. You get the heavy poison, and it does not heal when the fight's oh. done. Also, it sucks if you're trying to make a paladin, because uh, you, you can level your cure from uh, healing from the menu, but you do not increase your MP when you're doing that. Good to know. Don't do it from the menu. Got it. Which I was avoiding anyway, but... I would like... Oh, what? What? To my, control my controller died. Hold on. Excellent. I have a cable right here. Go in there. That's where we need to go. Also, because I... I think I remember a thing from Final Fantasy 2 is that uh, your ally or your fourth party member has has a trifling uh, consistency of uh, dying in this game. So uh, I'm just going to focus on the main three. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Summit Falls is beyond the mountain range to the south. Okay. Okay, that's fire three. A lot of color there? Yeah. Furion's weird. I mean, who isn't weird, though? It's an ambush soldier! Ah! Thank God. Guy had a shield to block with. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it detecting it as a P Xbox 360 controller when it's hooked up to the... Secret? Or is this where I'm supposed to go? It's where I'm supposed to go. Thanks, Max. For stopping by. Really appreciate it. Have yourself a good day. Take care. Guys. <laughs> so far, I'm because everything is so much damn faster with audio auto battle and stuff like that. I'm not having a terrible time. <laughs> That's good. Glad you're having fun. Because before, man, playing it on GBA, uh, these fights that are take like five seconds. Yeah. Right now took like twenty. Oh, I'm sure. At least on the original, or on the original, or even on the GBA remake, it's just like, no, this is sweet. I could just kind of hold square and just kind of plow through. This. You also need to hold it if you turn on. Anything. Oh yeah. I keep forgetting to turn it back on. Yeah, after you Probably should now that I'm in an actual dungeon. Oh, you made it to the mine already? I did. I'm looking for it. Those instructions are poor, though. <laughs> and that everything else is also much faster. Yes. <laughs> it's just, it's very, very fast that <laughs> in a game that's very grindy, all the grinding has been incredibly sped up. Like, four times as fast. <laughs> it's much, much more manageable. I think the only thing I'm not going to like about it is just the fact that, like, it's got to be hard to judge when you're, like, ready for a fight or something without, like, a yeah, number it, to it, say, it's... like, 
yo, it's, you should be at this level when you fight this boss, right? <laughs> or around this level. Yeah. Uh, there's, yeah, there's no, like, recommended level or anything. Like, the only way that I've been able to, or so far has just been, like, are you ready for an area or not is, it, do you get instant killed when you walk right. into an area you're it's not like supposed the, to It's be like in. the Elden Ring test. Does the first enemy kill you in one hit? Good. <laughs> Keep going. And don't go there. It's a very soft, uh, soft locky situation for progress. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Okay. I found it. I um, mean, there's still just goblins? Oh my god, come on, game. <laughs> I've been fighting goblins for the last hour and 22 minutes and 40 seconds. Come on. <laughs> Need something a little stronger so I can work on my shield skill. Okay, Crystal doesn't do anything. Cool. <laughs> so is the dungeon the first place that we see the stupid trap rooms? I haven't run into a trap room yet. Mm, okay. The tire good prioritization for auto battle is not perfect, but it's fine. It's clearly just spamming X is what the auto battle is doing. <laughs> Although it is neat that uh, if you auto battle healing, it will target a party member that is low on HP. I'm not sure if it targets the lowest HP party member, but at least it targets a party member that will get healed. Yeah. Should I have grinded for a bit of money to upgrade my weapons and stuff before coming into this dungeon? We'll find out. When I ended up at the place where I could buy bronze stuff, I already had all the money I needed to equip myself fully with it, so. <laughs> I got the armor. I just, I, the last time I was in had better weapons and I only bought one because they were expensive. The last town did not have better shields. They were still just hmm. bronze shields. Frowny Four face. doors. Which one to choose? Let's start the trap rooms, baby! Oh, hi, bombs. Yeah, man. Oh, that's... Redu what? That is not the description that was in the... Uh... Oh, it looks like I'm never going to use that. Uh... Would you use what? I got sap, and uh, the, the item description... <laughs> when buying the tome was just like, reduces your MP usage for the turn or something like that. Uh, that is not what it does. It just lowers their MP. It does the MP oh. damage instead of HP damage. It's like, no, it sounded like it was a buff for a character. Yeah. It said it reduces enemy MP. Then I'm a dangus and didn't see that. It's fine. Tom Adangus? Never. Probably should have warned you earlier today that I'm kind of in a weird mood today. Apologies, Tom. <laughs> you calling me a Dangus is your angry mood? No, I just salty, maybe. I, don't know. <laughs> I uh I don't know. I think it finally is like well, I was exhausted yesterday earlier than I normally am and Slept dreaming about my leave my old work all night last night. Mm. Let's start left and work our way right. Trap room, trap room, Slightly trap room. Here we come. Stressful situation. Let's see. 
I mean, like, I haven't felt stressed about it. Generally speaking, I've looked at it as, like, a positive thing in almost every regard, right? It's but, still a change, though. Right. And that comes with its own okay. trials. It's got a ladder. Trap room. Cool. Which I know that because usually, like, the amount of times I've moved in the past five years or so has just been, like, I haven't felt stressed about it at all. But, like, still, it's exhausting. Yeah. Get back to work now, Roddy? Cool. Another trap room. Another trap room. I picked the right door the first time, but then I still went through every other door just to make sure there was nothing in it. So did I. <laughs> you caught up very quickly. <laughs> Howdy, Greg. Thanks for stopping by. This seems like a trap. That sucks, Treasure Hardy. Chest. We're gonna find out. Get those balloons. Don't blow up. Oh, it wasn't a trap. It's surprising. It might be for the best that you don't use whatever cursed emotes you're talking about here. Because if it's as cursed as I'm expecting, um, it's probably not uh, acceptable under Twitch TOS. Oh, look at these slimes. Look at these gentlemen. <laughs> Very good slimes. I was somewhat tempted to do my portion of this stream from YouTube today, to be honest with you. So <laughs> you could have. You could have. I'm at the moment not going to transfer anything away from Twitch, but then again, it's because well, I'm not a professional. Nor am I particularly looking to grow my channel or anything. <laughs> Just, I'm doing this because I have fun with it. I understand the uh, people who uh, are <laughs> choosing to not anymore. Because, <laughs> uh, yeah, Twitch does seem to have uh, its head up its ass at the moment. <laughs> at the moment. Always. <laughs> Always and forever. Good battle theme, at least. <laughs> I do like the map, but that's one of my favorite things about like the. Oh wow, that pose. Wow, Minwoo has such a pose when casting spells. It's amazing. <laughs> I wish to keep Minwoo forever. They got level 7 Kier. Jesus. <laughs> and they're not afraid to use it. God, this encounter rate is so high. It is. I found people. Fuck. Also, hmm. Ooh, leave Furion alone! We saved them. It did not help that uh, the NPCs I was speaking to were just called Slave. Oh. So, uh, maybe we need to have a stern talking to the people we just saved. Oof. <laughs> Survive the fight. I do like that tension, though, about, like, not being able to easily revive your people. That is nifty, so. 
Mm-hmm. Did I just get the, an achievement these for... These early Final Fantasies are, are very D&D inspired. Or oh, yeah. D&D inspired. Yeah. For better and for worse. Indeed. Especially FF1 having the spell slots. For D, even. yeah. Which, again, like, I prefer the ones that have that, only because it's more true to, like, the original experience, right? And it makes spellcasting mm -hmm. way too powerful in the versions that switch to MP. I think the PSP one does that, if I remember correctly. That's why I don't like that one. <sighs> well, I mean, th this one seems to relatively balance it out just because there's no way to get MP back. <laughs> right. Really, at the moment. Hey guys, I gotta go check those two trap rooms. Hold on. Wasting my goddamn time. Okay. Yeah, how's it going? Oh yeah, Jesus Christ. Minwu can do a full party cure that is a full heal. heal. Yeah, it's <laughs> level 7 cure. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Furion, it's you! Am I ever glad you're here? This is Joseph's daughter, Nellie. I think that dastardly Bogan's been holding her hostage to threaten Joseph. Wait, who are you? This <laughs> is right? That's normally where I step in. I figured you need Mithril to get here. Oh, it's a me of all people. Thanks for this. Right, whatever. Okay, get out of here. <coughs> Further down yeah, we go. Man. Ambushed. They're all goblins. We'll be able to attack our way through this one. Oh, they're guards, though. Mm. Maybe we'll have a hard time. I'm sorry that you're having so much trouble, Roddy, with this uh, thing. <laughs> I'm trying to remember what the original Final Fantasy II speedruns were. If I remember correctly, they just use like a lot of teleportation or banished homes or something. Sounds and just good. rely on pure RNG to just end fights for them by instant killing everything. It's a very short speedrun if more quickly. Like 20 minutes well, or something. Well, the game's not that long. <laughs> Hell, we've only been going for an hour and a half and it feels like this would have taken three, four hours in the original. Good point. The monster variety could definitely stand to be upped a little bit. I feel yeah, like in Final well. Fantasy 1 we'd be fighting like at least like pink goblins or something. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> they would have at least gotten a palette swap at this point, for fuck's sake. I got a palette swap. I'm fighting goblin guards instead of goblins. Yeah, me too from time to time, but there's still goblins mixed in with them. Cole, hi! How you doing, Cole? Thanks for stopping by, Cole. Howdy, Cole. Everybody say hi to Cole. Except for Tom, because Tom already did. So. <laughs> I can say hi again. So it's excessive to say hi twice, but I could. Hey, if I have any mods or other people that know how to do it in my chat, go ahead and shout out Cole if you would, please. Thank you. How much that was, uh... See, like, the thing is, like, I don't mind pallet swaps in and of themselves as long as, like, stuff is changing with it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Um, I know some people are very, like, I can't believe they're just pallet swapping monsters and shit like that, even in, like, modern games and stuff, whatever, right? But... Mm -hmm. It's incredibly efficient. Yeah, and I don't... <laughs> and it, as long as the thing ha Like, especially when you're talking about a game like this, as long as it has, like, different moves or more HP or is more challenging in some way or something, give it something to make it different, right? Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I love Silver Athlos! <laughs> <laughs> I killed uh, Gold Rathian for the first time a couple days ago. So it's, it's in Rise. supposed to go. So that was fun. So, geez. Guy is getting some beefy strikes. <laughs> You're the boss. Love to see it. Stretch! I'll stretch when we get to the boss, because that'll probably be a slow arduous fight. <laughs> stretch and hydrate, huh? Right. 
Well, I don't know why you would need good vibes, Cole, because oh, whenever you okay. show up in my chat, you're bringing the good vibes with you. And now you're going to spoil it by saying something like Tallywhacker, aren't you? Why was Tallywhacker the first word that came to your mind? It seemed PG enough that I could say it without blushing and, uh, you know. Is that a boss? Or is that just a night guy? Let's get a line so you can say penis. I mean, I can say penis. Penis is the anatomically correct word, isn't it? It is. Or phallus. Dang it, I didn't want to waste that MP. Downside of the auto battle is there's no check. You kind of have to count turns to see when to turn it off when you actually want to change stuff up because it uh, does still speed up the battle. <laughs> Yeah, it's a boss. Okay, well, let's see how this goes, I guess. <laughs> we'll know very soon if we're, like, actually strong enough to do this. We'll find out. You ain't a gamer if you ain't thinking about cock. I mean... <sighs> this dungeon is making it very difficult to auto-battle, though. Dang slimes me. show up, and I do no damage with my physical attackers. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I might have a problem here. The first enemy resisted to my shield attacks. We might be here for a while, chat. <laughs> Please. I want to increase Furion's MP, but I only have I have five MP, and I want to save a bit for the boss just in case. Well, I'm gonna warn you: if your fight goes in like my fight, you're gonna need a lot more than five. <laughs> Is Minwu not even enough healing for you? No, it's not a healing problem. It's a damage alpha <laughs> problem. Hmm. I I'm using more than shields. <laughs> We'll see. I have a sneaky suspicion I know what this boss's trick is. Got him. Nice. And time. Time. Yep. That was the game. That's what we were fighting <laughs> to, right? Sergeant percent. <laughs> Oh, that's right. I forgot about backlines in this. Yes, that's you the actually thing. have to defeat the enemies in the front before the back ones take full damage. Forgot Maria, about Maria that. is in the back line. If you didn't move her, by the way. Yes, I have Maria in the back line on purpose. Move her to the front immediately. <laughs> Get up here. Start learning how to punch things with shields. Oh, Maybe you're we... probably a boss. Oh yeah, you just found him. <laughs> His boss's Hello. trick is he dies if you never thought I have to deal with your kind down here. Think you're getting mithril, you'd be right. My mithril braids straight through your heart. Okay, interesting type of music. Yeah, music is, yeah, I liked it. It's neat. Did you start fighting them yet? Just started. They haven't attacked yet. All right. How's it going over there, Tom?
This... I did 11 damage on my first hit. Okay, well, that's better than I was doing. <laughs> I think he's supposed to be wearing mithril armor. So physical attacks mm. do very little to him. Is the idea. Mm -hmm. I was hitting him for one with everyone. Ah. <laughs> Well, let's see what a fire three does. Probably more. 45. <laughs> yeah, there you go. So I just had to hit, keep hitting him with spells. This is what I did. I only have one character with offensive spells, so... Oh, boy. <laughs> I split it up. Everyone has one. <laughs> That's what I did. Firecast's not wrong. There were some attacks that were doing zero. <laughs> it's really dumb how well this is working. <laughs> Are you still fighting him? No, no, no. I beat him. Okay. I'm just fighting other stuff now and working my way around the dungeon and exploring the last little bit of that level because I didn't finish exploring it before I went in there. But just the stupid double shield thing. They block so much. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, my God, so many of my attacks are doing zero damage. Yep. See, uh, this is a thing. Guy, I'm gonna need you to land your axe hits. That's the one thing that actually does damage. Oh, 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 oh. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. That's actually really, really cool. Fuck yes, game. I love you. <laughs> what happened? Um... I, uh, I got a, a teleport tune. Oh, nice. Minwoo knows teleport already, by the way. Do they? Yep. Well. I really don't want to teleport away from here, though, because... Fuck! Oh, well, Minwoo, you can bring Maria back. Oh, Minwoo has revived, too. Mm-hmm. Oh shit, I didn't realize how it hurt. Nuggies and fries, nice. Jealous. Should check if I have money to buy dinner tonight or if I should make something. Yeah, have to some pizza rolls though. Yeah, Totinos. Yep. The only kind of pizza rolls, as far as I'm concerned. There might be off brand, not named pizza rolls. Salt and my ability to buy pizza rolls, Tom? Is that what's happening right now? Them's fighting words. Vampire thoughts. Ah. I wasn't counting how many waves of 120 damage it took to kill him, but it was a lot, by the way, so. Hmm. That's about how much I think I was doing per wave of me casting spells from everybody. Okay. Yield. Did we check this magic shop when we were here last time? Ooh, that's good. That also sounds good. Let's do that. All right. Come on. Now Maria also knows life.
Oh my goodness. Alright, how hard is it for me to get back over here? It's not too bad. You're gonna need to do more than one hit with your axe, guy. Yay, he's dead. Dude, that took so I'm long. Really bad types of chicken fries. Uh, make uh, turkey and rice. Let's... Yeah, I bought some real nice brand new pans and stuff, whatever, and I made eggs this morning. And it was so nice to, like, when I was done, literally just wipe, like, a rag across it and everything came off the pan. It was like, oh my god, a real <laughs> decent nonstick. I haven't had one of these in my house in, like, 20 years. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Totally worth the money. So yeah, I could definitely like fry up something. Yeah. There we go. I don't think we've been. I have enjoyed actually using my air fryer as of late. I think we've been here, yeah. Making plenty of chicken tendies. Mmm, chicken tendies. Nice, hand breaded, with nice. Lots of uh, crushed chili peppers and other spices and stuff to give it a really nice, nice kick. Yeah, I bought my first real nice chef knife, right? Fucking game changer. <laughs> Was this a mistake? This might have been a mistake. Fuck, I didn't save in forever either. Run away! Bravely, bravely run away. Oh, stop with the ambushes. Come on. All right. Good news. They were undead. Howdy, King. Thanks for stopping by. And they're asking what kind of chef knife did you buy? German steel. Beyond that, I don't remember the brand. I have some nice knives that I got recently because I, for the long, until earlier this year, I still had my <laughs> first knife set that I got out of college, which was just Walmart brand garbage. Um, so I finally got new ones and they're just like, yeah, the you should hand wash them only. You shouldn't machine wash them. And then I forgot a week ago. And uh, it sure did take a lot of the lacquer off of the wood. Oh, no. It's like, nah. Yeah, I mean, I hand wash all my knives because uh, I'm <laughs> weird like that. Is this a chocobo thing? Ha <laughs> ha, it is! The f iconic chocobo? Hell yeah. Let's go exploring. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Someone please hit, hit hurt this thing. Uh -oh. <laughs> you still fight that boss. No, I killed the boss, but now I opened up a chest and had a monster in it. Oh, yeah. Do yeah, anybody have uh, Blizzard in your party? A what? Blizzard. Oh. I... In case I run into slimes, I'm keeping my last little bit of MP. Okay. Because uh, my, my caster that could cast Blizzard one-shot that thing, so... Oh. Hmm. Well, I was... Gently suggesting, perhaps, you know, you try that spell. But it's fine, you know, if you need to save it for the other guys, I understand. <laughs> this game is tiny, holy shit. I've literally ran around the entire world of this back of this joke. Hmm, <laughs> hmm. Oh, yeah, it's very weak to the blizzard, all right. I now have zero MP. It nearly, oh, I have... Oh. It nearly killed Maria for me in, like, one hit, so... Cool. Oh, you're chef, that's why. Uh, yeah, I don't remember exactly. Just, I remember it was a German steel one. <laughs> Howdy, Calvi. I Thanks for stopping by. Don't have so like, the packaging or anymore. 
Kelvy! Hello! Sub, Kelvy. I appreciate it. Probably, I am doing good. You probably lose. I'm enjoying spending time with Sar. Minwoo here, don't we? I'm enjoying the game, weirdly enough. Mostly because of how fast it's going. I mean, I do have to say, like, from a narrative perspective, like, they got a lot more going on, which is good. Some of it's bad, because it's it, a lot of it's very much just like, oh, no, go talk to this guy, immediately do the thing. It's just like, okay, yeah. like, <laughs> like, a little build-up, maybe? But... It's, the characters actually have character this time. I love They were all character. blank slits in FF1, but still, it's, it's been... still very early days. <laughs> but why is Furion almost dead? But oh, certain items will get pitted and messed up from all the water sitting on the... Yes, exactly that too, right? Um, and then also, like, just because the way they kind of jiggle in there and everything like that, whatever, the edge tends to get really fucked up. So you definitely need to resharpen it properly. You can buy the equipment I made for you on the shop counter. This will keep my hands full inside. That's why I, I hand wash all my knives. To avoid that stuff, personally. But I'm a nerd! Who likes to sharpen my knives. Well, when you work at food service, you understand the importance of a sharp tool, basically, right? Yeah. Because when you have to use it all day long, it sure gets real annoying if it's not cutting well. Well, and you risk a higher of cutting yourself if you have that to too. use a lot of extra muscle to get through it or whatever, right? One to bask. Beth, Bethsks. I don't remember where Beft is, but I think I can just teleport there now. Maybe. I've already beat five hundred. Got that like. I'm hoping that's five hundred enemies and five. Not five. It has to be five hundred enemies, not battles. Here we go. I got that one like half an hour ago. Jesus. <laughs> Been grinding much more than I. <laughs> Been fighting everything I run into, you know. I haven't been going out of my way to do it. This is no sauce? What? Oh, well, that's, I mean, at least they're trying to help you out, Lime. I mean, I get it, but at the same time. Hate it when people won't give you the sauce. Wait, so how do I... Okay. Did I go up here then, I guess? Cut... Cutco Cutlery. <laughs> this comes from Cut... Oh, yeah. Guarantees are given on the... Cover. Well, I'll have to take a look next time I'm buying a knife. <laughs> That's a good question, Firecat. God, that would have helped so much. That's so much more damage. I, <laughs> uh, I could have been going through these battles so much faster. Why is that? Increasing my weapons to the next tier up. Oh. I only upgraded a single weapon before going into that dungeon. So, yeah, my damage was a little low. See, doodle. No. Oh. Ew. Oh, what? Damn it.
shoot. Uh, where is the building where I talk to people? This one. Did I not even talk to anyone here? What? I guess I didn't. Hmm. Hey, Envy One. Um, it isn't as bad as I was led to believe, but it's also kind of boring as fuck. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty bare bones. <laughs> and having everything sped up kind of emphasizes that. <laughs> yes, which definitely fucking helps. Yeah, playing this in one of its original forms would have been oof. I mean, I love Final Fantasy 3. Um even with that last bullshit dungeon like, the job system is enough to make it shine. You know what I mean? On its own, basically. <laughs> but, I get you. Remake is so good? Yeah. I have it on my, uh, my Super Famicom Mini or whatever. And while I can't even, like, read Japanese, I can still have a really good time just tooling around on it. Even in its original, you know, form, so. Which I believe that was even a remake technique. No, sorry, did I say Super Famicom Mini? It's the Famicom Mini. I did it. Chest contain a long sword, we gotta sell that. We're never gonna use it. <laughs> There's so many. Oh, zombies. shields only run. <laughs> I mean, I haven't bought weapons yet. <laughs> Got <laughs> weapons yet. Oh my god. needed them yet. At some point, I think I'm gonna get the Mithril Blade given me, right? Probably. <laughs> I do want to make sure that my spell casting is still going up, though, too, so... I'm gonna spam that a little bit in here for a moment. Yeah, I have my <laughs> spells on autocast for a while now. <laughs> I'm just like, I want to upgrade MP, I want to upgrade these spells, they're still pretty weak. Use <sighs> <laughs> 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 half boss HP, I, yeah, <laughs> right? Um. If you tur uh, turning into the canoe to cross a river made the airship that was flying overhead stop in its <laughs> tracks. It's <was> great. <laughs> they kept a weird amount of jank. Why are you Is it really that bad to try to use that thing? Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, Roddy. The fact that it had to be one at a time sounded scary to me to begin oh, with. Oh, I can't cross into that? Oh. We're gonna have ten at a time. Oh. Mm -hmm. 
So many shield blocks. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. You didn't even upgrade your shield to a different one since the starting one? No, I've gotten one upgrade. Okay. There's only been one upgrade so far. Dude, it's about 220, jeez. I do like the graphics in this uh, mm -hmm. pixel remaster, though. Pretty good. They look pretty, pretty good. Wait, are you on? I still need to return the mithra to the mithril to the castle. No, no, no. I was checking to see if Guy was on level four for his spell. Oh. Um, so I'm kind of <laughs> grinding all their spells to you right now. Guy is just a physical attacker for me. I'm not gonna put anything on him. Just gonna give him battle axes. Everyone is kind of clones, but again, I told, like I said, I split the spells, the black magic ones across them, so they can all be mm -hmm. doing a little bit of that. Therian's then... becoming more of a red mage who uses swords, and Maria's just a pure black mage. Nice. <laughs> not even giving her any white magic. Maria's got most of my white magic, my utility spells, but everyone's got gear at least to level 3, I think, now. Everybody's just doing a little bit of everything. <laughs> I mostly just want to get MP up. Oh, hi, Basks. Mm, they won't even talk to me. Just having to wait. That sucks, Ready? I'm sure they're getting slammed right now, too. Mm. That guy surely doesn't look like a leader or anything here. Ooh, okay. Um... Although leveling up some of these spells doesn't make any sense. <laughs> what does leveling up S. Yuna do? Does it heal other status ailments? I know it's about to happen. Do we do we need some O sevens in chat? Maybe. <laughs> I'm gonna leave town and try and fight one of these. Save. Fight. Oh, I should have saved. Oh, Fuck. No. Oh, I can't fight these guys. Lane. Fucking kidding? That's amazing. <laughs> okay, I should turn it down. I'm guessing I'm about to lose <laughs> Minu, though. Right. Oh, 07 Minwoo. We surely never saw your death coming. I don't think Minwoo dies. You just leave your party. That was nifty.
Wait, 220? Jesus Christ, it's expensive to sleep here. <laughs> I think the the inns are proportioned based on how much gold you have. It, so it feels like it's so specific that it's not... It has to be based on something. I have a fuck ton of gold, so it makes sense. Start blasting. So uh, this one, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. We're turning the mithril. <laughs> Take it to the blacksmith. Uh, who's the blacksmith? Right? That's what I said. When they told me that. You're just some kid. Oh, there you are. S strong hammer strikes with those sound effects. I think every town Tink. has Tink. different percentages, too, if that makes sense, right? Baby, give it to me. This is so dumb. This is so dumb. <laughs> no, that's not optimal game. That's optimal. My attack numbers are low, but I have a 96% evasion rate. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I had enough Amazing. money. I had enough money for everyone to get two mithril shields, full mithril armor, mithril helmet, everything. Okay. Two baths. 
the Lucky Basques. <laughs> I want to do shit for damage. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. Bye, Minyu. It's gonna really suck with you out of the party now. Oh, seven, Minyu. What are these? Oh, my fucking god. That's what I gotta talk to him about. Take me there. game didn't really give me a hint where I need to go but I think I have what I need so let's go to the thing maybe we'll see it's a fancy looking dreadnought you have there be a shame if someone went and sabotaged it sure would yeah, it did, Rodney. Don't worry about it. Tom hasn't gotten there yet. I'm gonna go check that other town quick. Oh, that's a canoeable. Oh, hi. Back to work? What? This is not the sound effect I was expecting for the dungeon. It's fine. So it sure would be nice to fight different enemies about now. Yep. <laughs> I'm in the next dungeon and it sure has more goblin guards. <laughs> sure do. These zombies have some nice shoes on, though. Got some Jordans. They sure do. Rocking those kicks. Try to remind me to save when I can. Then a second again. Oh, what you call it? Mm. Were they called balloons before? So if not, that's not even a palette swap. It's the same. It's the same sprite. Mm 
<laughs> oh, really? I'm gonna look at the map from now on to make sure I know exactly where the treasures are. Right. The, the, the spawn rate for enemies is so high. Yeah. Please, I thought. Okay, wait. I got another word now. Yeah. Okay. I think I know what it means. That... Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh shoot, I need to be running. Keep forgetting that I can run. <laughs> I'm expecting a game like this to not be able to run. <laughs> Save in certain locations. I on the overworld, I believe. Yep. Yep. Hi. Dreadnoughts Bridge complete. Oh no. Curse you. I wouldn't tell Tom what to do next. <laughs> Let them run around as I did. <laughs> no, I would help you if you asked, Tom. But I'd make you have the shame of asking first. <laughs> Don't describe it as a shame. It's okay to ask. That was a... Hmm. Everything seems to have been bombed. That's neat. games a lot. <laughs> oh, what? Why didn't I get that before? Wait, what is this? Oh. Just find the item. Well, no, I found I found a pass. Yeah. It's really nice of them to give it to you so easily, isn't it? Did you not grab it? No, I grabbed it. <laughs> when I, leaving the dreadnought? I did. I just or... laughed. I was like, oh, because they make it sound like it's going to be a big deal to find it to get on board the dreadnought. It's like, oh, here it is. <laughs> cool. Just in this chest, this room right here. Mm-hmm. Which I know a little bit about the Dreadnought because um, there was an event in Brave Exodus when I was playing it where they had a whole Final Fantasy II event and one of the levels they brought one-to-one -one in was just the Dreadnought. Hmm. Now the question is, how do I get to the dreadnought? I'm gonna go back to the exploded towns first.
<laughs> Good. Good. At, least my, at least my evasion is so high. <laughs> I got ambushed. Not a single enemy hit me. <laughs> How's it going, everyone? Having a good time here? Which town are you in? Uh, the one you went with your boat to. I don't remember its name. The one where you get the airships from, whatever. I haven't gotten the airship, but you can travel by airship. From. Yeah, 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 that's what I meant. Oh, you can travel by airship from. Okay. Jesus. Take me back to the Paradise City where the grass is green. Okay, I'm fucking looking this up. <laughs> Do you have no idea where to go? No, I, I know where I'm at the where I need to go, but I've encountered a uh, a blockage Mm. And I don't know how I'm supposed to fix that blockage, so. Oh, well, it looks like I had to go somewhere else first, so. Got it. Everyone okay in here? Got it. Oh. Got it. I did it. I protected the dreadnought. I, oh, you you asked me to stop the dreadnought. Okay. Whoopsies. Well. 07, Minwoo. Catch you later. You haven't died yet, so there's potential you'll come back. I learned what I I did wrong, and when you get to that part, if you want me to tell you, I'll tell you. Need to go talk to the king. Basically, uh, hmm. Maria woke up and was just immediately decked again. Yeah, right. <laughs> Which, the amount of damage they're outputting now that they're at level four hands is ridiculous. That's what I was gobsmacked about <laughs> earlier. It was like, whoa. Because <laughs> a um, uh, guy hit one for, I think, 150. And uh, Maria hit one for, like, 110. <laughs> with just punching it with the shield. <laughs> oh, Okay. <laughs> This appears to be viable, <laughs> still. Hmm. Yeah, I, I did not keyword a specific person uh, with the keyword I needed to keyword, and now I have to return to keyword with the keyword, and then there's a different place I have to go first to deal with the keyword with the keyword. So, that's your hint. Yeah, I have no idea where to go now. I can tell Immediately. You. Well, I can tell you if you want me to tell you. It's the only thing. 
I can continue to search in random places. I'm a lot stronger now, so I can go to other places if I wanted. Good. You don't have to, though. Like, the, they didn't give me any hints on what to do with the dreadnought. No. So, yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> What's the next step, sir? Talk to Sid. Gotta love the running back and forth forever. Yes. <laughs> Sid will have a new keyword you need. I already have airship. Reza what? What? Reza what? You want to say hi stream? Is that what you want? Oh, hi. Oh, well, thank you for the kiss, Reza. Where's your good puppy? Hi, Reza. Meh. So good. <gasps> thank you. Thank you. Yeah, here's your good puppy. Why? Take a puppy a second. Yeah. Yeah. Good girl. Good puppy. Okay, now I just need to go up there. Let's we'll walk. It's fine. Uh, uh, oh, 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 I love backtracking. <laughs> Look, I did that, and then I goofed up something else and had to backtrack again, so... <laughs> Heads up. Now, what do I take the Sunfire to? Do I take it back to the castle? I can't tell if you're legitimately asking me or not. I am. Yes. Yeah, talk to Hilda first. Uh, Hilda will give you information, but don't immediately do what Hilda tells you if you don't want to, like, do what I just did. This sucks. This is really bad padding. <laughs> go back to the castle. Go back to Sid. Go back to the castle. Oh, oh, don't even worry. It's gonna get it's get worse. Yeah, nah, it gets worse. Amazing. I'll just I'm just gonna tell you. Make sure you talk to the king about the sunfire too. Okay. That's your that's your hint. Mm-hmm. Hilda! I have some news, and by news, I mean I have a thing. Kashuan <laughs> Keep. Don't go there yet. <laughs> what can you use to bring Sunfire back? I'm assuming that's what the king will know. <laughs> Goddess's Bell. Known only to the Kashwan family. Okay, now you go to Kashwan. No! No to me or to you? No to Go speed. talk to Hilda about the bell. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> wow! Yeah, you're gonna love this next part too. Bell well, rests deeper than a cavern on the snow plains and not be used uh, in the snow cavern. If only Gordon were here, there would be need to as danger. He's so he must. There's nothing I could do for him. Because Yosef knows the snow is plain like back <laughs> now. You can see his council. Who's Yosef? 
I don't remember. I don't know who Yosef is. Yeah, you probably haven't talked to him yet. Also, howdy, Nicole. H, H, hi, and hemlo, Nicole. A lot of eyes. Uh, <laughs> you don't start. He's just an average high schooler. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Who's Yosef? <laughs> Sar, who's Yosef? Okay, do you remember the town uh, north of the cave that you had to go to with the first dungeon? The snowy town? Yes. He lives there. There? He lives there. Okay. That makes sense, at least. It's weird that they called him out by name and not any of his <laughs> location or anything, but at the very least, that location makes sense. <laughs> Location makes sense because they want you to go to the snow fields. Right. I just love traveling on this boat five times to. <laughs> well, I've had it <laughs> finally progress. I've had it sitting in like it's been on the other side of the thing for me since the beginning, so I've had to walk around every time. Oh God. Yep. <laughs> I've airshipped Yo, a lot, but... <laughs> also, how do you rag, though? Is this a better way to get out of here? Bye. It's not gonna work. Let's find out. That'll work. It's a way better path. I haven't taken that way before. I am too strong right now, game. Come on. <laughs> too strong punching everyone with shields. I didn't know that Nicole likes snowflakes. That's cool. <laughs> snow fields. Oh, snow fields. Oops. I mean, Mrs. Fields has got some pretty good cookies. I mean. <laughs> Ooh, we got some palette swapped enemies finally. Oh, baby. It's about damn time. Oh, did you gear up when you were in uh, the castle town? I got neutral weapons. Okay, okay. So, yeah. All right. Just realized I should probably have mentioned it. Oh, he joined the park. Welcome, Yosa. Now I can't ask him more information. <laughs> <laughs> and he is a monk, apparently. Yes, he is. He fights by punching. Most powerful way to fight in this game. Also, he said it was hidden by blue stone. I don't know what room he was talking about. Is it this room? Nope. You're back in the mines already? <laughs> You're backtracking already? Well, is that where it is? Where Keeps the snow from have hidden in the first floor of the cavern of the Semite Falls. Great. Yep. <laughs> you gotta go backtrack to the first dungeon. Oh my god. <laughs> this sucks so much. Well, I went back to the keep, and at the keep, I'm like, okay, I can't get to this door, and I can't do anything with this. What the fuck did I miss? And this whole side I quest with getting... I gone to Cashwan Keep yet. Yep, yeah, well, I've been there a couple times. And, uh, yeah, the fucking monk... This is like, well, we're like, oh, I'll get Yosef on your team first. We'll go get his, uh, gotta get his snow vehicle. You love retro gaming? I like retro gaming. I degree. like it. Yeah, to an extent. Playing something like Daggerfall is tough. I really enjoy it, but at the same time with, like, the progression systems being as jank as they fucking are in that, it's tough sometimes. Um... Or even like the older Dungeons and Dragons games, any like the gold box ones, I think would be really hard to play too. This is just very hard games. Which I don't. I want my challenge to be like. challenging, but not like. I want it to be challenging in a non BS way. Right. In a way that feels like you're not just. Padding things out. Like the Basculus room at 
towards the end of Boulder's Gate 1. It's literally just like, here are four enemies that have instant kill abilities each. Have fun. Sure hope you brought the one or two items you need to get past this room. Or you can cheese it. <laughs> when Boulder's Gate 1, you can cast things like Fireball off screen. Why is the Snowcraft in a chest? <laughs> oh my god. I think it's worth my time going over there. <laughs> to the snow fields. <laughs> oh, good, I've ambushed. <laughs> Nicole, please. <laughs> I do kind of feel bad for Yosef not having any shields, but since they're just a temporary character. Or so you think they're temporary. No, I know. I know. I know. I know. I know. <laughs> Pretty sure every fourth party member is temporary. Uh, until you get the last one. Which is what? You're probably your original fourth party member? Yeah, it's Leon. Maria's brother? Yeah, it's Leon. Who is at the moment a bad guy. No. Oh. Spoilers. Uh huh, Nicole. That's, I'm sure that's precisely what you were talking about. No idea what any of you were talking about. Too busy playing an amazing Final Fantasy game with my friend Tom. Yes, was the new protagonist. I mean, if this was fucking. Uh... God damn it. Um. Why am I blinking? Ooh, that was dangerous. Oh no. <laughs> oh, that was nifty, but I'm never going to use it. Thanks, game. <laughs> it was a weapon. I suppose I should try to conserve MP, because it's probably a dungeon. A normal pure one. Did you catch up with me? Goddamn asshole. I'm not in the dungeon yet. I helped you too much. Now I'm in the dungeon. I helped you too much. Yeah, you're right. You, should, <laughs> you, should have, you shouldn't have helped me. You should have watched me struggle. Look, it's, it feels nice to be ahead of the professional speedrunner for a couple seconds, right? You gotta cut me some <laughs> slack, right? Even though you did technically cheat and look up the ends. Yeah, I mean, yeah, never mind. Only after walking around the keep for like, I don't know, 15 minutes, smashing my head into everything in there. <laughs> Is this dude why you need to touch this? This lant. Oh, this uh, candelabra over here looks suspicious. Maybe this is the answer. <laughs> the answer was it was not the answer. Also, curious. I'm way overpowered already. Somehow. Yeah, me too. And you're just punching things. I actually have weapons. Yeah. <laughs> but we're still like one shotting most of the stuff in here by punching it. That icicle took three hits, but that's fine. <laughs> Considering they can't hit me. Ooh. Skeleton with the sword that also died in one <laughs> Everything just dies. Love watching Tom struggle. Oh. 
I didn't know you even knew the move struggle there, Tom. I was out of PP. That's a Pokemon joke there, people. Not often do I run out of PP, but when I do, I do struggle. You're a good mod, Roddy. <laughs> But Roddy's not a mod in your chat. Not in my chat. <laughs> That's why it's so annoying. I get you. I wish there were more ways I could hit multiple enemies other than all casting magic. Yeah. And all casting magic is so weak. Yes. Right now, it's most optimal for me to just auto battle on regular attacks. The uh, fire doesn't seem to be too bad. Like a fire four against zombies does okay. I don't even think I. I think one character has one level four spell for me. <laughs> well, I just went through I, before I came in here as I was overworld walking between all the places or whatever. That's what I was working on. Is getting to level four elemental spells. Oh shoot! I just remembered that the splat fed is fest is right now. It is. And I've never played a splat fest, so I haven't either. I'm gonna do um, team uh, fun, I think. Whatever big man has got. I want to go with Big, big Man, big man cuz he's excellent. But also I would be whatever team gear whatever practical in reality. <laughs> See like but the thing is I don't Which need I gear to survive cuz I have the skills that I do so. like. So Joseph's hands leveled up can't catch these hands. I guess I could get him, like, worse shields. I didn't sell any of my old equipment. Why? Game? Why? Why are you... F why <laughs> are you scaled this way? Why are you giving me a regular battle axe? Not anything special. <laughs> All the gear that I've gotten from... <laughs> Dungeons is stuff I can always already buy for not that much. It's like, yeah. why? Oh. Every time I've wanted to buy something, I've had the money for it. So. Alright, I decided to give Yosef some shields. So he can, <laughs> he can, he can be part of the team properly. Yosef's just Oh, oh, team. oh, it's the part. Okay, chat, pay right, quick touch. We're ready, right? Snook Chet. Snook Chet. Snook Chet. Snook Chet. Snook Chet. <laughs> Snook Chet. Alright, alright, you ready? Ready? Snook Snook Chet. Guy, speak, beaver. Snook Snook Chet, ask about this. Secret passage in the wall to right. Monster guard bell. Bell in wall. Thanks, guy. I will stretch when we get to the next. Uh, when we get to the next boss fight, probably. The one moment of guy having something unique about him. He speaks beaver. Canadian.
<laughs> Encounter rate is so high. <laughs> let me go. Not even challenge for me. I like when the monsters start running away from you. <laughs> I'm not to that point yet. Ow! Stop blowing up. That actually hurts. They are, yeah, those ones. The good news is every time Maria takes one to the face, they get like a ton of HP afterwards. <laughs> What are you gonna play, Nicole? <laughs> Here's your pack game. Yeah. That's fair. Well, I have an extra scroll, so, uh, guy, you're learning a spell. Hey. It's about guy time. <laughs> Also, best of hope you have safe travels back to the U.S. of A, where it, it's probably more annoying to be. <laughs> Netherlands seemed like it was very nice. Yeah, I got to the beaver bit. <laughs> Does sound very nice there. Feels nice to have a city that you can, you know, walk through and take public transit that actually exists. And is quick and efficient and useful. And lots of people use it. <laughs> Instead of a massive inconvenience to try and plan around public transport here. Let's see I if... looked up how long it would take me via public transit to get to work. <laughs> Two hours, one way. All right. Well, I know how this fight's gonna go. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? <laughs> okay, I was wrong. This fight's gonna go a little different than I... Are you doing no damage? Yes. Kind of. That's why I have level 4 spells. <laughs> Dead. The enemy is dead? The boss, yeah. Or you? The boss. Ah. I think I killed this one in three turns, so. Jeez. <laughs> Why? Why are you being so needy? Why are you being so needy, puppy dog? What? I know, you're a good... What, you want to say hi to stream again? Come here. Up, up, up. Oh, yeah. that's okay. Hi. Hmm. Hi. Why are you wanting so much attention? Ah. Okay. Uh, 
that's gonna not be good. That's fine, whatever. Now we leave. Giving you pets for chat. Chat wants to pet you. I know. We'll go for a walk soon enough. Fuck me. Okay. Ah, <laughs> oh, you... I see a love, but now I need to show up. What the fuck? Because I got... Uh, fan gamer put out more Hollow Knight merch in the form of minifigs, and they're adorable. Look at this grub. Look at it. Look at it. It's so cute. All right, mistakes were made. Look at it. It's so cute. Very good grub. I also have the hornet. Yeah, okay. Also hornet. You can Shaw and Hedina. Very good. Okay. Cool. Miner is nice. She hung as little clear boom above on good, her head. That's a good point, Roddy. Very good. And then you also need to be grumpy. You no, know sometimes you're just in a zone type. Big grumpus. <laughs> Chat, you ready to cry? I love them. <laughs> what happened while I was gone? While I was showing everyone figures? Don't worry about it. Did you die? No. Okay. <laughs> yes. Roddy, you're not wrong. Oh, wow. Okay. I could... Oh. It's a good secondary. <sighs> Why the ancient sword is my primary weapon decreases my accuracy down to 30% is beyond me. Oh, Maria's blinded. When did that happen? Oh, hi. Greetings, beavers. How are you doing? <laughs> Amazing. Why can guys speak beaver? <laughs> And the character fa that had, has had no speaking lines up till this point. Yes. Other than <laughs> dangus type remarks. He's saying hi or something. At one and, point, right? he, and then he, uh, he just can speak to beavers. Yep. 
you know nothing about him except for now he's a dangus and he can speak <laughs> to beavers. <laughs> they call me beaver X. Yeah. <laughs> Stop blowing up! <laughs> but it's what we do! I'm running out of cures. That's not good. Well, it's probably not that big of a deal, but. <laughs> well, so howdy, Brian. Thanks for stopping. <laughs> <laughs> no, I accidentally close. Minimize your chance and point oopsies. Oopsie dotas. Maybe I should just run away from bombs. Instead of letting them explode. I promise I could ambush by them and then they would still blow up on me. Into these gentlemen before. Hi, dual heads. How strong are you? You're pretty strong, actually. Not that strong. You're pretty strong. Not that strong. I found the boss. <laughs> Good work. Good luck on that one. Are you still just punching pieces of shit? Oh yeah, hundred percent. And but like the, the hilarity is the fact that I still have like a ninety nine percent evasion rate currently. Hmm. So like nothing hmm. is hitting me, like most <laughs> of the time. What's Adam Antoy's weak to? Blizzard. Is it <laughs> more Blizzard then? The chest turtle fight was just to prep you for this. Mm hmm. How much are your physical attacks hitting it for? Oh, Yosef just crit it for like 130. Nice. Then Maria's using Blizzard 3s for 200. And the fight's done. Two turns. There you go. Good job. My, my physical it. hits from everybody were doing zero. So I was like, well, <laughs> it's a good thing I can spell cast. Take the bell, and I'm sure there won't be any traps whatsoever when we take it. No, but I thought it was really cool. I didn't realize the bell thing started here or whatever from, you know, Final Fantasy IX with, uh, what's that kind of oh. Whatever, there's like the ton of the bell stuff. Clara. Going on. Yeah. Or Bermesia. Wait, no. Yeah. No, Bermesia. Uh, right? Giz Gizamook's Cavern, specifically. Well, Gizamook's and then more at the, the tree, right? Oh, well, the, in the oh town, too, there's some, too. This dungeon design. It's actually normal dungeon design. It looped back to the beginning when you were done. Yes. Yeah, oh my weird. god. I wonder why they would do that. Oh, hey. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> sure, that second phase. Hello. Curses! You've already gotten the bell. Fight two. That is not how I was expecting you to look. Sir, uh, I hope you like fire. Fire four did not do much. 
Oh my god, I finished him in one turn. Good job. <laughs> Surely nothing bad will happen on this staircase, though. Surely not. Booby trapped it. Oh no! All right, Tom's check. Get, get ready to cry. Start running. He clearly said he booby trapped it and start running. You fools. Yosef, no. You can't hold it on your own. If he can hold it on himself, I'm sure just with a guy. You could have helped him. Oh, seven, Yosef. Oh, seven. Given a swift and dishonorable death so that we could get a new party member. Yeah, that's fair. So how am I liking Final Fantasy 14 times two games earlier? Um It's a good question. It's boring. It's very <laughs> boring. It's very cut and dry. If I wasn't streaming it slash hanging out with Tom, I probably would have turned it off at some point. Which is kind of why I was like, Tom, do this with me! <laughs> I've always wanted to experience this. You're experiencing it. Yeah, but I thought you were going for like a 352 days over whatever joke. Sorry. <laughs> Hi, Copper. Thank you for that rate of 15. Really appreciate it. Copper. Oh, well. I was talking earlier today because Ox. Ox. Oxen. Was playing. Oxen. I think. It is Oaksen. You're right. <laughs> God damn it. Oaksen <laughs> was playing 15 earlier, and I've showed up in their streams a lot to give them shit for playing 15, because I fucking hate 15. <laughs> um, and, like, the thing about 15 is I really like the story of 15. Like, 15's story is actually quite I good. I never got far enough to care about the story in 15. But the gameplay is so bad. It is. It tried to make it for a very casual audience, <laughs> and it's uh, just not deep or complex enough to make it worthwhile. So, like, well, if somebody did a video, I don't know when it was, a while ago, it was like, is it still worth playing in 2020 or something? And they argued yes, and I was like, all right, let me go back and try this again or whatever. Because, like, if you have, like, a PS5 and you have, like, the one pack or whatever, you get the Royal Edition. I was like, well, maybe I'd like to play through some of the DLC or whatever like that, whatever, right? Yeah, I didn't get far enough to care <laughs> before I had to turn <laughs> off. Because literally the combat is you just sit there and hold one button. So, mm -hmm. You have a 3D model for your VTuber? That's exciting oh. to hear. I didn't know Copper was getting a VTuber. Exciting times. Um, let's see. Now, we go back. Do we just go to the Keshwin place now? I'm assuming so. Yes. Cool. It's on like half of the tower now, maybe. 
The easiest way to get here is to go to the uh, airship vendor and fly here. So they'll drop you off right at the door. I don't know where it is on the map, though, and I want to know where it is on the map. If you go to the airship guys, they'll drop you off at it. But it's like there's like a like a circle, like a crescent of mountains on like the uh, right side of the map. It's in the middle of that. It's your base, which you need more assets for. Nice. That's super exciting here. Oh, oh, we need that. Finally, something worthwhile from a chest. <laughs> Other than a purely progression item? Yes. Well, I've had a couple that were, like, in that last cave, there was a bunch of mithril weapons in there. But again, mm -hmm. like you said, you could buy those. For you could have bought those. Whatever, right? Um, they weren't, and then the they were kind of expensive to be fair. And the silver armor is different. You got that right. Uh, I was able to purchase that already. Oh, were you? It's, I mean, it's exactly the same as Mithril anyway. So mm -hmm. I would look down like, why is this even in here? It's the exact same stats as the Mithril armor. <laughs> oh my God, the enemies in here are starting to run for me now. I wasn't expecting this to be a dungeon. I like Arden's story is pretty cool. And uh, all the Luna Freya stuff's pretty neat. Just a shame that. Uh. I can't open the key. Can't ring the bell at the door. I tried it in the... Apparently I didn't try it. It also shatters in your hand, so yeah, that's definitely from Gizmo Look. Pretty cool. Are you our new fourth party member? Yes, and they're terrible, sure by the way. Sure are. Hi, and Gordon. And they're terrible, by the way. Great. <laughs> this is the like mine, because they've got like half the health of... Wow, I gave you some of my spare equipment. I hope you appreciate it, Gordon. I mean, it is a good sign that I am hungry and I've decided I'm going to order food because <sighs> I want to keep going, so. <laughs> we still have like an hour or so before you got to yeah, do gonna your D&D. Make food, I would have to plan accordingly. Mm -hmm. I'd probably dip it six. The fact that we, oh my God, there is, there is, like, I was like, I was starting off, I'm like, okay, it's fine. We're still really early in the game that there's little enemy variety. We're two hours past that point. We're still seeing the exact same enemies. Yeah, I think, have you got up at the tower at all yet? No, I'm it, just it, starting. I think it changes a little bit as you go further in, because I think the, you can get here pretty early. Uh, so to prevent you from instantly dying from the enemies on the first floor, I think that's why the ones down there are okay. pretty. Because I was here. As soon as I got to the airship, I came here for the first time just to be like, oh, I can go explore all these cool places. What's this place? And I realized it's a dungeon. I'm like, oh, no, <laughs> this is terrible. Uh, but the good news is that there's a uh, Chocobo forest just south of it. So I was able to get uh, out of here without too much trouble. 
more like gob- Whoa. But I didn't read that one. <laughs> you also made one technically? Made one of what? Did you, Nikki? That's exciting. Oh! Very exciting times. I've always... Nah, never mind. When are we getting an all-dad VTuber? Never. <laughs> Use face cam. The closest thing you're gonna get is the little goblin VTuber over at Deer Street. <laughs> or I guess we more like a cold, kind of cobalt-looking demon guy, I don't know. Trying, like I, I, like a part of me wants to have a model, just because it's neat and I like seeing them. But, like I don't know what mine would be, is the big thing. That's fair. Like, Because it wouldn't just be an anime guy, because basically, like, every game I play, like, I pick the female protagonist. <laughs> like, it's not like I'm like, oh, this is this is what my character usually looks like. It's like, no, I usually pick a female protagonist immediately. So there's, like, nothing from games I can really, like, use as reference for, like, I want to be like that. <laughs> sure. Actually, hmm. Maybe an Orin type of look, maybe. <laughs> Orin maybe that good. would would work. <laughs> but generic anime guy protagonist would would not fit me. Well, that's one of the problems I ran into when I was doing VR chat stuff, you know, relatively frequently and stuff. It's like the only decent dude models out there is like Kurito. and like the billions of permutations he had or whatever at the time. It's like I don't want to be <laughs> fucking. Jesus, Torito model. <laughs> God damn it. So I was running around with like Republic Commandos, uh, clone troopers, and stuff like that, whatever, because that was like the only stuff I could find that was like decent and wasn't a fucking Torito. <laughs> oh, fuck me. This could be very bad. Hey, game, give me fire five. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> this could be bad. When was the last time I saved? Fuck. <laughs> oh, my God. He survived. Hell yeah. <laughs> Oh, I didn't stretch. There wasn't. Oh, yeah, that's right. There were bosses. They took two turns. These things. Well, two turns and one turn. These things have self destruct oh, yeah. five, Tom. And that hurts. But I won. <laughs> Regular attacking. Ah, <laughs> uh, monster chest. I don't think Nikki just... is fibbing there, Pick. Sorry to disagree <sighs> with you. Nikki is not a known fibber. 
Ooh, that one had a golden shield in it. Did you get that one, Sar? That's what I was super excited about. Oh. <laughs> I was like, finally! Equipment for me! <laughs> Mickey's a gremlin? I don't think Mickey's a gremlin. Wow, the Adamantoys is already a, a regular enemy. Yeah. That was fast. with ice which is i mean how they are in the first game too <laughs> although ogre mages in final fantasy one are way scarier than they are in this i feel like most of the enemies Get. in this game are not very scary no maybe grenades <laughs> <laughs> bombs yeah bombs exploding on you has been the only thing that's really done considerable damage to me also, get sleep, Nicole, and have safe travels back to the Usa. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Those are actually some good chests for once. Yes. Okay. Okay. Are you alive? I'm alive. I'm confused. <laughs> and I'm also hoping this thing doesn't have a billion HP. Wow, nice crit, Adamant Boys. Jeez. Right, <laughs> Fire Cat. Serve some MP. <laughs> I 
Well, rip Gordon. <laughs> it's someone on my team knows life, I think. No, I didn't want to waste MP. That's not super bad, chat. Okay, maybe, now I need to be really careful. Maybe seven or eight turns for us. That's the way things are going right now. I think it's out of MP too, which is nice. Okay. Oh, it's a good thing that didn't do much damage. <laughs> yeah, basically. <laughs> Just realized I didn't say goodbye to Nicole before Nicole left. But goodbye, Nicole. I'm sorry, I didn't say goodbye. I was Can't distracted by this song. boss fight. Tom's gonna beat this boss a lot faster than me. That's for sure. Your shields were not that effective. It's not awful. But you'll see when you get here what the mechanic is for this one. One dad you think standing streams? Yeah, probably. <laughs> cool. So much stuff leveled up from that fight though. <laughs> So that's the advantage of a long fight, eh? Oh, I have a garlic. And an Antarctic wind. Ooh, that actually is pretty nice. I got blink from a random drop. Nice. Ah, uh, no. I think I found the monster chest that you were concerned about. Probably. You know, self destruct five. Yep. Oh, good thing Gordon took one of those. <laughs> Did he die instantly? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're fine. We should be. Yeah, we're fine. Gordon wasn't fine. He's taking a little nap, but. A little nap. That's called foreshadow. Oh no, what's happening there? Hey. These are just the default names, Master. Mm hmm. Oh no, the Ogre Mage actually used the spell. What the hell? Yeah, they kind of hurt too. <laughs> Gordon. First time I've actually seen them actually do a thing. Shit, Gordon killed the thing. <laughs> it was something out of the tower, but still. <laughs> Gordon's doing okay damage for me. I gave him a spare mithril sword that I had. No, okay. I guess I could have given him a weapon. <laughs> <laughs> don't really care. I gave. Yeah, I just upgraded his equipment from old stuff I had. 
Oh, I realized that Yosef took one of my shields with him when he died. Damn it! <laughs> my bronze shield, I'm never going to get back. Nah, that, that reminds me of a freaking Pro ZD skit. Just like, no! I can't believe you die. Don't worry, Dennis. It'll be okay. I gave you my best equipment. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> I'll never get it back. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, I think maybe I, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna bet on this one. I'm gonna say we gotta go. Not back to Hilda yet. Oh, fuck! There's no way for me to get over there without getting rid of that. Okay, well then, that's what we're doing. Let's... That's where we turn. <laughs> Why are you trying to hydrate? I'm out of water. Why are you trying to waterboard Tom, Nikki? Jesus. I will hydrate when stream's done in like a half an hour. <laughs> I still disagree with the gremlin assessment. Just saying. <laughs> I would. I. I don't know enough yet of Nikki to to specify gremlin behavior. Look, I mean, I will self-admit that I'm I, a fucking troll, like, you know, anybody, <laughs> his business. Yeah. Like, I, I can I absolutely say that Lime is a gremlin. Not sure yet if I would call Nikki a gremlin. I don't know, Lime's really sweet, what the hell? <laughs> gremlin doesn't mean you're bad. Lime has means you're never a done a single gremlin-y thing ever. Never. Never once. Oh, hi, Mom Bomb. Red Soul, whatever the heck you want to call it. Cop is doubting my hmm. chat. Let's use a blizzard. Let's use a blizzard. Let's use an Antarctic wind. Oh, I didn't check any of my items. That would have been a good idea. All right. In. Shit! It heals from ace attacks. No! <laughs> Ice Storm 16? Was that Antarctic wind? Jeez. Okay, fuck. What about fire? <laughs> now nah, wasted that Antarctic wind. Nope. Okay, do you just mimic any magic I use? You ass. I'm thinking that's what you do. Okay, fine. Time to just beat the crap out of you. Or not. Do I need to use healing items on you? What the hell? Oh, I didn't try that. Right now, he's just hurting. I have a heart of a lime. Might want to get that nope, checked by a doctor. Nope, not thunder either. Okay, well. I guess we just attack? I don't even know. Oh my fucking god, are you kidding me? <laughs> Why is Gordon the only one who can hurt this thing? Oh, never mind. There's there's some good damage. There's some good damage. Apparently, we just had to bust through shields or something. <laughs> I had one turn of good damage, and that was the fight. Oh, you beat it? Good job. Yep. Yeah, it's just every spell it absorbed. I tried warping it. I tried tele uh, teleporting it. Those It also healed off of. Oh, 
And where was the chocobo forest? South of the thing. Just straight south? Yeah. Mmm, the one glowy spot in this forest. Don't forget to grab the flame, though, if you didn't. I got it. Do we got to go to Sid now? Um, well, that's what I'm figuring out right now. Uh, I I'm got... think it would be appropriate to go to Sid. Yeah, he wasn't there. Oh. So I went back to Hilda. And they weren't there. But talking to uh, whatever the White Mage guy's name was, I'm blanking out right now, he was like... They went to meet with Sid to go meet you because they felt bad that you're doing all this hard work and they weren't doing anything. <laughs> and apparently they got kidnapped, so. Ah. I have so much money. What do I have? <laughs> How much do you have? 23,000. Ah, you're ahead of me by only 500. <laughs> 22,500 right now. We should get the rest of my party gold shields, though. So I'm checking one place. No, it's not here. Okay, I'm looking it up. Because <laughs> the amount of walking around and backtracking or whatever in this game is ridiculous. It is very high. Oop. What? Oh, okay. Uh, well, Sid didn't do squat. I found him. He's at his usual spot. He didn't do anything. Oh, why is he at the usual spot for you? Mm hmm. I have the torch. Did you light the torch? Light it. Oh my God, Tom. That's why I said, did you grab the flame? No, you said, did you grab the torch? God. Well, you need to go to the bottom of the tower and grab the flame. <laughs> there would have been a cutscene and everything. Well, he's turned since. So you can just fly up into the tower and still hang <laughs> It sounds like you have to go back to Hilda and find out that she's missing, and then the dreadnought will be northwest of uh, whatever town the Altier. Hmm. But I'm back by the tower now, so I'm grabbing a chocobo. <laughs> Take me to Kashwan. Because the, the tip they gave you was that the Dreadnought has to land at some point for resupplies. And I'm like, oh, it must be back as dock. Mm -hmm. And it wasn't that stock. So. <laughs> The heart of the cards. <laughs> there he is. Oh, hey, look, a fire. <laughs> Come on. I, mean, I could have swore I asked if you grabbed the Dang fire, it. not the torch. I apologize if I said the torch. You said torch. Fool. Um, I made a mistake. Oh, I made a mistake. <laughs> also, 
Hmm, yep. Well, this might be the end for me tonight. <laughs> have you still not saved? I have not. What? You've, what? You've said multiple times. When was the last time I saved? You wouldn't... Oh, yep. Uh, I'm fucked. Okay, cool. Mm. <laughs> hey, uh, make sure you don't talk to the guards. Yeah, I knew that. I tried fighting one the before, and I was able to flee. I can't flee. So, I guess I gotta try to win this. <laughs> Oh, okay. You know what? Gordon's the only one that's gonna like get one hit by this guy. It's fine. We might get this then. <laughs> oh no, airship! Run away! You're being chased. Oh, and captured. I'm assuming that was intended to be Sid's airship that just got captured. Yes. Now Sid won't be there anymore. Bird. <sighs> No, they're not at their spot. Who could have seen this coming? Now to take the long hike back to the castle for the 20th time. Why couldn't you just take the airship to the castle before? Alright. bosses I've fought so far. <laughs> Are you just fighting a, a regular guard still? Yep. God damn. I mean, I think it's the exact same one from the beginning of the game, just now that I actually can take a hit from them. Hmm. Got it. It actually wasn't too bad, other than Gordon dying every time it's said to look at him. Hmm. Guys got to level six shields. Actually, that actually worked for me. Leveling up shield stuff. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, out of the place. And uh, let's save. Okay, so I'm at, I'm at three hours and thirty one minutes on my playtime. My last save was <laughs> two hours ago. Or uh, was it two hours? It's an hour and a half of progress I would have lost had I died to that fight. All right, we saved. <laughs> Good. Half. They said it landed north of Finn. Northwest. They just said north, but I'm heading there. Dreadnought, where are you? It looks like he's flipping them off when he casts. It's great. Like, this is such an evil empire, they're just surrounded by zombies and shit, and they don't give a shit. They don't give a <laughs> fuck, excuse me. Oh. What?
Um... Come on! That's bad. How far north? Um, you gotta go all the way around. Oh. Meanwhile, I'm just purposefully wasting all of my magic to get abilities up. <laughs> just have auto battle on magics. <laughs> nice. Let's get something. I've got auto battle on shields. Other than Gordon. Okay. Gordon's just casting here. Playing with fire, but I mean, yeah, you know me. I'm a rascal. That's why you all come to watch me stream, so you can see the heartache of when I die and I didn't have a safety save for like two hours. <laughs> what That's is this happened happening before, right what? now? It's a chair. Greg, I don't remember asking for a shout out for a killer chair yet. Jeez. <laughs> Cher, thank you very much for that raid. Really appreciate it. Hope you had a good time playing games and demos. Why was it games and demos? Weren't you playing the, Thanks, the digging of shovels with a knight? Yeah, it was good. <laughs> I was talking earlier about how you were playing 15, and I've I've decided 15 is the worst game. <laughs> Played like several games today. Nice, Cher. Oh, there's the dreadnought. Beat SK Dig like twice today. SK, Damn. SK Dig. Shovel Knight. Oh! That's right, the dick came out, didn't it? Mm hmm. Okay, but you can put Goofy at 15, but I can understand if I can't. See. Like, the combat is the biggest problem I have with it. I really like the story. I, I think that the story is worth telling and is neat. Um, but, like, and I, I tried playing 15 recently-ish, and, like, the, it's the whole sitting there holding one button thing. Right, that really gets to me. This is a trap. So don't, tar don't talk to the guards on the airship. Yeah, don't. <laughs> Yeah, that's my biggest complaint. I, I like the road trip aspects of it. I think the relationship dynamic between each of the characters is one of its strongest suits. I think all the, the like, the, like, weapon stuff is stupid, too. Like, uh, and then the version, when I first played it, right, you couldn't switch between any of the party members, too. So, like, playing as Noctis can get kind of old really quick, because he's a, really a one-trick pony with what he's doing, basically, right? Yep. <laughs> um... Although I see you use like warp strike way more than I ever did when I played, so maybe that would make it a little when more fresh. Buy, but, I but to be fair, when you buy Final Fantasy 15 now, they just start you off with stupidly powerful gear. Yeah, that too. But like but going like the warp strike will like one shot things for like the first five hours of the game with the weapon they give you at the beginning. Jeez, it's dumb. Which like collecting all of the like 
the ancient kingdom weapons or whatever like that was kind of neat, but at the same time, like, I, I, I think I got, like, most of them, and I'm just like, but every time it's the same thing! So, like, <laughs> it's just, I don't know. Uh. And to be fair, I never did play the post-game dungeons. I hear those are, like, much more challenging from, like, a challenge perspective. But, like, I don't really know. Hi, Queen! How's it going? <laughs> Queen! Oh, and like, just for the people that just joined or whatever, my entire party is just dual wielding shields. Except for this guy. I don't like that guy. So. Do I have to. There's a chest. Alright, we're gonna go for it. And don't get me wrong, this game is pretty boring, too. But, like, that's been its most offensive <laughs> trait. It's just... It's boring. <laughs> every, like, five steps you take is a random encounter. Like, and if I yeah, didn't have... Like, it's... It's kind of like a situation to me with... Because uh, the Mega Man X collection came out. One, one through four are excellent. Um, five and six are still pretty good. They're... So there's some annoyances with five and six but they're still overall pretty solid uh and then seven everyone hates the most and then eight they said was an improvement from there and i disagree <laughs> seven is just incredibly boring <laughs> it's boring but i can play it at least and not be too and like get through it eight was uh i hated the design of eight <laughs> I thought the level design was so much worse and like worse in like bad and not just boring. <laughs> Which says a lot. <laughs> oh no. Maria's gonna die. Oh, Maria didn't die. Maria, how did you not die? So my characters are throwing hands with shields attached. <laughs> And it's super effective. It's been pretty good. I haven't hit any roadblocks with it yet. I do have everybody's like spell casting like decent so they can like cast like I think level four or five spells at this point. So that if I do run into something that they don't have enough oomph to get through their defenses, I can burn them down with spells instead. And it's been successful. There, there were two bosses in this game so far that, like, had very high physical immunity, but, like, no magical resistance whatsoever. It's like, mm, yep. interesting. <laughs> so the only enemy that's a giant pain in the ass is the bombs. Yeah. Let's have them blow up on me. Also, because everything scales with how much you use it for healing and for stuff, life costs one MP. <laughs> oh my god, I'm s I'm gonna die in this tower from fucking bombs. <laughs> the airship? Yep. I just got ambushed by five bombs. Oh no. It's like, cool. You're here now? Nice. Oh, I found Sid. Yeah, I found Sid in the least them already. I'm assuming I need to go down over here. I got an achievement for the amount of money These I have again. <laughs> Hell yeah. This training arc. Appreciate it. They are best character. Anyways, is this not where I need to go to blow this thing up? 
Alright, my food's out there getting cold. I'm gonna grab it quick. Go get it. I suppose I can just put this on all the battle. Let's just fight it. Wow, those are really good gloves. Oh. That's a really easy iron gate to open. <laughs> good, good, good defenses here. I'm actually really screwed if Furion dies. He's the only one who knows life. Well, fuck. <laughs> now I need to leave. <laughs> now I need to leave and find an inn. These are going to be really solid fights for a while. All right, I'm back. Welcome back. What kind of food did you order? Uh, noodles. Oh, nice. Noodles. I have a new strategy for fights. Let's What's run. <laughs> Just run. Well, they killed Furion, and Furion was the only one who knew life, so I can't revive anyone anymore. Oh, you don't have an extra life tome in your inventory like I do, just in case? Nope. Something I was like, hmm. That would have been the nice thing to do. I'm staying for the last five minutes. I got raided by chair, I think. That's the only thing that happened. I think. I don't know. I'm gonna grab my food. Oh, good job, Roddy. It only took you three hours? Jesus. <laughs> I want to reach the end of this dreadnought before stream ends, but That's I have to run I'm all the way back to a town. To too. <laughs> it's my goal. It does look like I'm running out of time. Does not help when I keep running into bombs. Are they going to not let me leave? <laughs> nope, they're not going to let you leave. Fuck. I don't even know where we need to go to. The I rescued thing, the princess and they won't let me leave now. I'm looking right now. One second. Well, now I'm definitely just fleeing from everything. The Dreadnought is the first possible. dungeon in the game where you cannot be re revisited, so you'll want to make sure you get all the chests before using the Sunfire to end at this point in your map. Blah, blah. Okay. So yeah, I can't. I, I'm literally not fighting anything anymore. I'm just running. Fucking self-destructing, you assholes. Oh, I'm ambushed again. God damn it. Come on. Yeah, it's the best Final Fantasy. Hi, Zeus. Thanks for stopping by. It surely hasn't been described as from both me and Star as Sar as a uh, boring. Hey, it's nice to meet you. I'm Star. I'm a brand new streamer coming up in the world. Stargoto. Stargoto. 
original character do not steal. Makes me feel better. I'm sure it doesn't, but I've been blinded most of this dungeon, so. I have some eye drops remaining. Damn it, run before they explode. <laughs> Stop letting them explode. So for those of you that don't know, this game's kind of weird too, because like you need to get hit or take damage for like your health to increase and stuff. What is your health by the way right now? Like roughly, what's your, what's your uh, guy's health at? 717. Okay, I'm at 809. Well, yeah, well, you've been taking a lot more hits than me because you have shields. <laughs> I'm just letting them just shield them. <laughs> yeah, because of my shields and my shield skills and everything, I have like a 99% evasion rate or something, too. Hmm. It doesn't help against bombs, but. I'm so tired of the bombs. Oh, good. I found some bombs. This might be bad, actually. But if you want. <laughs> yeah, keep blowing up on Guy. He can take it. Yeah, pretty much. I, I can't do anything about my dead party member. <laughs> I was smart and gave life to only one ally. Oh, shit. Now that's a problem. Hmm. I'm gonna have to bust out magic. I might run out of MP though, that's my risk right now. Taking them off, right? Wow, okay. Uh, really need to kill this thing quickly. Keep forgetting to have potions. Fuck! What happened? Uh, Murray is also dead. I found oh. a monster chest with a hill gigas in, and that might be the death of me. I have no real way to heal. Only crits are doing damage to it. Oh no. <laughs> so it's just all guy. Your casting damage, right? Come on, guy! Is Gordon dead too? Rip. Yep. Well, thanks for checking out Final oh. Fantasy 2 with me, Tom. I really appreciate There's it. There's autosaves. <laughs> are there? Yeah. Oh. Well, then I, I would have lost at, an hour and a half. Back at the, the floor. <laughs> Cool. I got put back at the same floor I was on. Firion's still dead. Then whatever's in that chest, though, that you'll never know. You're probably right. <laughs> I don't have anything set up to deal with the Hill Gigas at all, especially not with Firion dead. Okay, well, fucking, I got ambushed by a Hill Gigas now. Great, great. Okay, I'm gonna go over this chest now. Let's see. Is it in the one room with all the guards in it? Mm hmm. <laughs> Poor cat, you're not wrong. <laughs> oh, I got one too. Here we go. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. That is a problem, hey? Mm hmm. Right, let's see if I can blast it. Magic. Hey, kitten. Cat. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Um. Hmm. Interesting. Have a ton of health. Let's go for it. God 
damn it. Just run. Stop letting them explode. Oh my god. I want to fight against bombs because they all exploded. You want to fight? Yeah. There were no enemies left and I didn't flee because my characters failed. Out of potions. Don't, 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 don't do that. Shit. Having a fun time with the hill, Gigas. No, I killed it. Oh. A lot of magic. <laughs> Run, you fools! But I am very hungry, and I have 25 minutes until I got the Indian, so. <laughs> so I assume I'm Hurry up, Sar. I should look at this quick to see if Make anybody... it quick. been discussion in my discord Let's see. Why did they have to make a maze of guards at the very end? Oh. You know, the worst part is. Go if up, you, left, loop around. The worst part is, like, even if you beat them, they don't disappear. Oh, great. <laughs> By the way. Amazing. Guy's gonna get so much EXP from all these bombs blowing up on him. I mean, health. <laughs> <laughs> he really got like 50 health. <laughs> Guy, you're the MVP. Right. Heal everybody. Let's just toss a little sunfire in the engine. I'm sure it won't cause any problems. I'm also running from the fights right now. What have you done? The engine. I don't know. Who could have possibly? What Sid suggested we put it? <laughs> Maria recognized the voice. <gasps> Who could it be? It's Leon. The only person that Maria knows that was ever hinted at at all. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get the Hill Gigas chest. What was in the Hill Gigas chest? I didn't get that chest. I just, you said you beat? I, I fought a random hill? one. I oh. killed it. I'm like, all right, that's good enough for me to know that I could do it. And I just kept going. <laughs> It was magic that oh, it took, chests. and it was like 50 like damage a spell, no matter which element it was. It had, didn't have any weakness. Yeah, Fucking it was sucked. very strong. Yeah. <laughs> Later, Dreadnought. No. The dr it's not going to be around much longer. <laughs> Oh, I saw that little island with a cave on it. Secrets for later. Also, it's a very anticlimactic, the ending there. There's no boss. <laughs> no, no boss. Oh, shoot. I need to go back here first before going to the end.
to shoot. Ow, church was. Uh, it did. Bring him back. He deserves to live. He's alive. He's fine. Deleted. There wasn't even a boss at the end of the Dreadnought. The path is getting the dead friends, yeah. <laughs> no, no boss at the Dreadnought. Let's look at the guide here. All right, Queen. Where would you send me off next? Oh, you're not. Why aren't you there? Oh. Hello. Everyone doing okay over here? Ultimate magic? <gasps> the ultimato. We're literally halfway through the game. <laughs> really? Jesus. <laughs> yep. That did not take long. Short game, yeah. So we just did the Dreadnought, the, the, at least by chapters, according to this. And then I got Layla Dragoons and the Dice, the Colosseum, retaking Castle Finn, Mysteria, Tropical Islands, Mysidian Cave, Leviathan, and Mysidian Towers, the Cyclone, uh, and then Palamecia Castle, which is the, the final. Oh no, sorry, Pandemonium is technically the final. But mm -hmm. either way, like, yeah, we're on like step six, and there's 14 steps total in the game. So yeah, right about halfway. <laughs> In what four hours? <laughs> hmm, hmm. All right, but I'm starving, so I'm gonna save here. Yeah, I found the next keywords needed to hop on a ship to diced. Like I don't know if it was like more because it's it's very laser focused. On, like you do one thing, do the next thing, right? If there was, like, some mm -hmm. side quests and stuff in there, or some, like, slower build-up to certain things, like, it probably, like, narrative actually wouldn't be too bad. Mm -hmm. Um, and then the encounter rate needs to get tuned way the fuck down, and also make a secret oh, yeah. more easily, Jesus. like, create your characters how you want them to be, instead of, like, them reacting to everything happening around them all the time. Mm -hmm. Which I get what they're going for there, but at the same time, like, you should be able to lock skills or other things like that, whatever, to prevent them from going down or up or whatever. I don't know. That would be yeah. the minimum thing to do to make that more playable, so... That's my thoughts. Better than 15, but not by much. Most of the time, you need to use more than one brain cell for the combat. That's the only reason. That's the main reason. Yeah, there, why. there's so few brain cells. Okay, you get an ice shield from the. Oh, package. no. Yep, you fucked it up. And I just oversaved my save. Damn it. <laughs> back and get that goddamn shield all right who we raiding tom uh good question i don't know who's live that's a good question i'm live you are uh, uh let's see here i see gamer live crystals live gamer, crystal gam viz That raid everyone all at once. You others. <laughs> what, what what are you in the mood to watch? I think deer's Even you're not gonna be watching. Well, I'll, I'm gonna be eating second so watch for a bit. I think Gam's probably the best target out of those ones. Let's add a game. Yeah. You can watch watch I'm playing the new Gam, game. Dig it up. Right, let's go see how to game. Thanks everybody for stopping okay. out. Really heckin' appreciate it. If you're not yeah. already following McAnalyst Tom, go follow McAnalyst Tom. Go follow Sar. They do really uh, cool speedrun stuff, and they're going to be at RPG <laughs> Limit Break in a couple of weeks. I will. And I'll be back for another stream tomorrow for speedrunning that. And lots yeah. of streams next week for speedrunning that, because I need practice. <laughs> yeah. Very good. Yeah. Does All that right. mean we have to... F you said we're over halfway, so... Or, like, at halfway. So does that mean we have to finish this? It's up to you. Really? I mean, I, I was, I'm tempted, like, if my D&D &D game doesn't go off tonight to, like, get back on later tonight and keep grinding away at this, honestly. 
But if you would want me to wait and we can continue this, we're, we're roughly around the same time with each other too right now, which is mm -hmm. weird too. Because normally when we do this, I'm already like two hours behind because I've been dicking around and doing other things, whatever. And I was ahead of you most of today. Of course, at the mm -hmm. end there, you beat me by running from every monster, but you know, it's, it's fine. All right, the raid's going right. off. We'll discuss it. All right, yeah, we'll so, figure so, it out. Come up with a plan. All right. <laughs> Have a good one. Goodbye. 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 My raid is away.